prepare you. A green pickle, not a yellow one. A green, a green pickle, eh? Hello, pickle time. Let's go eat some pickles. Yes, what are we doing here? What the fuck? There's a chest down there and scroll. Let's get the chest, you know. You're gonna touch this chest? Oh, it's tier 3! Hell yeah, 95 monies! Ooh, I like that. I like that a lot. Who, who I likes this? It's from my Ave! Oh, hello there. It's my Ave's chest. Yeah, it's... Yeah, it's garbage. Actually... Oh, he doesn't have elemental armor. What is it? It's, we don't need that. We don't need that garbage. <laughs> See, we can craft a pickle on this. Oh, I can put pickle on it. Twelve. Two of these, two two pickles would be put on it, and then we could put a pickle on it and make it even better. Pickle. It loses five pickles, thirty pickles over the thirty-five pickles. This gives health restoration now, and it gets, I mean, it's 12% elemental resistance, and it gives it to everybody in a form of team to read this. Uh, it's a pickle. We're in a pickle. Hey, 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 we're in such a pickle. Oh, it's gone. Can we craft you free? No. <laughs> Why not? I got I mean, look, even these change. Oh, that's pretty cool. Look at that. Everything has its own. So all four tiers have their own things. That's pretty cool. Look at that. I remember what I didn't do last time. Oh no, I don't remember. Oh no, we did look at the Eye of the Shade, which is tier 5. We can never craft tier 5, so that is extremely unique, we got tier 4, tier 5, we're getting tier 3s on this level. We're in a pickle, there's a mighty pickle, there's a lever we can touch, and a letter, geometric shapes, Triangle zero one eight zero zero one eight zero. 0180, Somewhat simplistic code. Add a code for that. Let's keep hold of it. Zero one eight zero. Touch this. How do you know what they're doing? Your champions turn eleven left and right after a few tries. And suddenly, every team position marked on in green. Everything is green. Oh. Let's read this letter. It's gold. Oh, gold. So, so far the goals were 44 on this level, and let's see if we can roll 44. Okay, I feel like it's only going to be 44, which is good because it saves us time. Even though we can re-roll now because the loading times are good and it's not flickering anymore, like on the previous level, it still saves time. And 44 is a lot more than 30. No. Plain table, a couple of bottles of wine, which have stored vinegar over time. And remains of one man's last meal. What was the last meal? Their own skeleton? And why are they assuming the position? If this was Dark Souls, there would be a... A finger but whole message. There's also another person. So they were eating the other one. That's a first date gone wrong, so you don't want to date a cannibal. They might eat ya. Let's see this letter. Captain Brompton, that is British as fuck. I'm writing to yet again express my strong indignation at the lax... Lax attitude of both you and your company. You may believe that we are safe from the day by year, but we must remain vigilant against their encroachment. 
enemies merciless and just be on the doorstep. Yet you and your soldiers are often seen drunk. Drunk, sir! Oh my god. <gasps> and while on guard at that, we, the ages of the tower, should comport. What the hell has that comport? What is comport? Oh, no, I don't know. Is it compose, but but like older? Comport. What does that mean? I've never seen that word in my entire life. Comport. Com. Com. Port. Ah, behave. I see. I. Alright. It's a mage word ourselves accordingly whatever the circumstances i insist for the hundredth time that you enforce discipline in your ranks and in yourself sincerely captain roman b it looks like these men had one less hurrah they assumed finger but hole there are worse ways to go letter mentions deva i have no memory of this word our elders they'll say it's long ago Deavers, uh, d what d is that? Is that allowed to say Deavers? Beavers? What if it a D? They were said to be impervious to magic perhaps The sim similarity is more than coincidence. They are the shadow people, you dumb son of a bitch. Like, not these shadow people, but like the void people. Come on, they were. This tower is steeped in the improbable and fantastic. At each passing moment, my doubt of the old tales wanes. Captain Roman B's ladder. Okay. There's a, fa a form of fountain! That looks not good, but we'll drink it. You'll drink it. You haven't drank fountain in a while. Ah, Speed decreased by two. That's okay. You don't need speed. Yeah, I mean... Oh my god! Oh my god! His negative speed! His negative speed! I didn't know you could go into negative speed. He's definitely not going to attack. He's going to attack slower. Does it make him slower? It doesn't make him slower. 10% apparently just... It's just... Whatever. Wait a minute! The hammer is rank 3. The flow hammer. I don't think I realized that ever, or maybe I did. I don't remember seeing that it's rank 3. That's pretty cool. Oh yeah, but fire, because we're attacking skeleton tier 3s, which are robots. They don't like fire, and they don't like water either. Why? Oh yeah, I gave him the fire because it has magic penetration. The hammer doesn't, and it's basically the same deeps. A little more deeps, but 24 with no penetration. Or 20.4. 23% extra damage on that. I mean, it's basically the same, right? Uh, depends. The enemy has 20% resistance to both of them. You know, this already gets decreased by 20%, but this won't. I don't know. It does, doesn't really matter. Let's just scroll! These are always good. Oh. Hey, Bob! Hello! Once again, completely unsure about what you play. Have you heard of Frasier? Is that a series? I think I have. I'm playing Tower of Time. Ever since I started playing Tower of Time, you thought it was Hitman? But it's Tower of Time, I'm not old. It's my throat. I'm not, it's my throat. It is a series. Yeah, I, I heard of Frasier. i never seen it. There can never be perfect unison between body and mind. If the Master Archer can achieve such... Ah, yes, the Master Archer. But I think she doesn't need more speed because she's got like 30. Wait, she had 30 last time. What happened? Oh no, he's got 30 mastery. Never mind. I guess she can benefit from more speed. Yeah, sure. Cocaine. Mm. Crack cocaine! Tower of time doing sense you became old. No, I'm not old. It's my throat. It's just my throat, man. 
metal sculpture. That is a pretty sculpture. Is that floating in the air? What's wrong with all these blasted lamps? Previous floors were well lit, but there I can hardly see my hand in front of my face. Hey, it's emergency lighting. Let me take a look. A cat moves to inspect a strange metal container hanging from the wall. A few moments later, his face turns into a frown. His entire face is a frown. What is Fraser about? Tell me. Yeah, right. I need lamps of some kind, but don't I use any fuel I know of? Not water and oil. Sorry, lass. No idea how to light them. What about the metal sculpture? Towering sculpture of metal and gears. Hank refers to it as the Iron Tree. Monolith. This is floating in the air. Oh no, it's not. Kind of. Raise the monolith. There's another metal sculpture, so these might be a thing later on. I don't know what the fuck this noise is. Like a zipper. Are you a zipper? It's like it's screaming at us. Hey, teleporter. That's the first teleporter on this. Oh, there's another fight. There's another fight. What is this thing? Large stand birthday. Strange stand for installation manual. Oh my god, my neck is bleeding. Oh no. So, long story short, I got stabbed in the throat. But I can talk now. Oh, but it's bleeding again. What the fuck? Welcome to my neighborhood where you get stabbed in the throat. Strange stand flickers. Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> it's a thing here. The strange, it's a birthday manual. Strange stand flickers with light displaying bold black letters. The time and neglect of damaged parts of stand and not all the text is legible. Champions can read the following. Thank you everyone for the well wishes. After a lot of encouragements, I've decided to have the party on level 2 after the end of shift. Hope everyone can attend. God damn it. God let these days, dark days, keep us from living our lives. Yeah, that's right. Just because there's a war somewhere. I mean, what? But please, no birthday presents. Engineer Ashley. Okay, we're good. That's uh, pretty fucked up. Yeah, right? They don't have lighting, but they're throwing birthday parties. Earth. Birthday. Birthday parties. Expedition journal. What is Fraser about, Bob? What the hell? I ask you a question, and you just sit in silence, like you always do. <clears throat> but that's okay. Just a little pick at your face about the stabby thing. That's okay. Some people stab you in the throat, and others. Others stab you in the heart. I feel like I'm on the lucky one. And I'm not saying I stabbed the other guy in the heart, but I could have. <clears throat> I had a tattered notebook lies in the middle of the floor. Upon closer inspection, it appears to be a personal diary. As one of your champions leaves through it, most of the pages crumble to dust. Only a few in the middle are legible. They really like this word, legible. It's the third time in these notes. The previous one had legible. This one is legible. And then there was another one, either on this floor or the last floor's end. And there was another legible thing. Which is why we are forced to abandon the others and retreat to this part of the tower in the first place. My dreams are still haunted by the memories of the people we left behind. Like Lorraine. Each night I pray we somehow prevailed over the Dewa. But as long as these cowards refuse the power of the main generator, I'll never know for sure. So yes, it is the emergency lighting, and we need to find the generator. So easy. Having aligned myself to a party captured by two buffoons, and I fully regret my decision to leave the others. Rompton, which is a silly name, is a drunken cowboy, and Roman bees as thick as a brick. He's a f he's thick. Now they ever, how they ever rose to a position of authority over the rest of us is beyond me. He's taking the notes in my stomach grow tighter. Ah, he's got cancer. Stomach cancer. 
I wish with all my heart I'd gone to the upper level with Lorraine and the others. They're fucking dead. Dead dead. Alright, Bob. I have to do the thing myself. You will not tell me. Well, how do you write it? Fragier. Fra oh, you were doing a, a wall of text. I'm sorry. I just looked it up. Fragier is an American television sitcom that was broadcast on NBC for 11 seasons, damn. 1993, September 16, and it ended on 2004, May 13. What? It's about this guy named Fraser Crane who used to be a therapist but recently moved to Seattle Now has to take care of his old father, though, though he got a care caregiver for him that is British and slightly a psychic. He's got a brother who's a therapist too, and his sibling rivalry with him. To moving to Seattle, he became radio call and show host. He helps people that call into his show. What the hell? I never knew what it was about. I've seen the pictures, yeah. I, I... I see the uh, the cover art or the cover picture, and I I know what this is. I've never seen a single episode. It's one of those old series, you know, back when I was in 1993. <laughs> I was an infant, so I didn't really watch these kind of things. I wasn't even born yet. That's a spin-off of Cheers! Ah, oh, Cheers! Uh, that one right there. That one's a good one. I've never seen it, but I heard it's a good one. So it's probably true. Oh, well, Enchant! Magic best in one! Wait, I already have this. Oh, leg armor. Wait, wait. Whoa. We got it for chest and leg! Ooh! Oh my god, this could be... Oh man, if he could have it for everything, so... 2, 4... 40%? Then we can still have the resistance aura. Oh, but the ethereal absorption is better than the measure I bastion. A lot better. But for the chest... This is garbage, this is garbage. Oh, this one also has... Wait a minute, what the fuck? That's crazy. What do you have here? What do you have? Elemental. Elemental aura. She could have ethereal absorption. I mean, it wouldn't really help her much. It doesn't have a lot of, like, half a percent. Like, one percent of two hundred. Like, what? Two? She would get an extra one mana? Uh. What? What am I saying? Yeah. Step voice in the house, sell the back in my day. Thanks. Eh, 44. Let me see if I'm still bleeding. Wait. I think it's not bleeding now. That's okay. Alright, time to fight. That's good enough. So, again, against these enemies, it's fire and water, which is the best. We got fire, we got water, we got fire, and we got the tank. No one else is needed. Just kill him, kill him, yo. Oh, that's new. Destructoid! Airlancer, Elite. Oh, God, it's. Elite Mage. Guess what? That's literally the ghosts on floor one. Ugh. I still don't know what this is. <coughs> Alright, Bob. It's enough. It's enough. I've done it for 23 minutes. Starting to hurt. So, yes. So, I shall tell you that the whole stabby bit was a lie. And... I don't actually live in a neighborhood. 
I live, I live in boofafuck nowhere. So, yes. I mean, we do have neighbors, but not in a neighborhood in the traditional sense. Feel a little woozy. There's also some ketchup coming out of my throat. I knew I shouldn't have eaten those gas station hot dogs. <laughs> there was some some metallic aftertaste to those hot dogs. <laughs> There's a a sharp sharp sensation after swallowing that hot dog. <laughs> Although my neck is bleeding. I mean, it was. Uh, I just I don't know. I may have scratched myself or something. Or maybe I did get stabbed, I don't know. Anyways, uh, we have the auto cutter, auto cutters, yeah, fire and water. We, we've seen these three, but these are new. Destructoid. Isn't that like a some kind of online magazine or some bullshit? A giant construct that was once used for heavy mining work. It is highly durable and has high armor. Oh my goodness, 62 armor. 50 armor penetration. It got it's gonna drill a new butthole onto us. Also it has the ability to increase its mass temporarily, distorting gravity in a small area around. It's fat! This is a fat joke. Alright. You're so fat, you can increase your gravity. <laughs> gravity pull. Distorts its mass. Ew. Pulling all targets within four meters towards its center. Okay, that's nothing. Um yeah, okay, so fire and water is still just going to tear its asshole open, and earth is still decent. So, so far, no problem. Although, it's 50 armor penetration, that's... I mean, Kane has, like, 98 armor, so... Oh my god, but it deals also 100 damage. She, they... That's... That guy's nasty. I, I seriously think these number, or these little icons mean how much of the enemies are going to be there. So we're gonna have some RC-32s, mechanical mages, destructoids, air lancers, and elite mages, and the crap ton of auto cutters. And the auto cutters are just the running running boys, but they die easy. Like, they have no life. They, they get two shot. I thought it was a bit at first, but you were committed to it enough that I started to believe you. And that's how I roll. I make you think it's a bit, then I keep it up, you start to believe, and then I then I go, ha ha, jabated. You got fooled, boy. Yeah, I do that. You know, back in the day, there was this cartoon. There was a Tarzan cartoon that I used to watch after school. Like, if I, if I got home fast enough from school, I could catch the show as it started. Or something like that. And sometimes I couldn't watch it. But I would, uh, I would tell my sister what was in the show. And there was a time when I uh, didn't see it. But my sister asked what was in the Tarzan show, or cartoon. And I made up an entire goddamn episode. And she believed it. And then I told her it was fucking... It was a lie. And then she didn't believe that it was just made up by me. Yeah, I'm good. I'm a jokester. Yeah. See next time, boy who cried stabby throat. <laughs> I mean, who knows? Maybe, maybe now the universe is gonna be like, "Aha! You're, you're joking about getting stabbed in the throat." <laughs> well, let's see who laughs last. Yeah, maybe, maybe I just put myself on a list somewhere. Some throat stabber, stabbers, stabbers uh, united is now putting me on a on on a list. Next target, this asshole. Does it help that you don't usually put on bits out of nowhere? I'm always putting on bits. I'm a bit myself. Yes. I'm a one-bit character. I'm shallow. Balancer. I knew that was used as a peacekeeper and a guard. It attacks at short range, shooting energy bolts from its spear. Occasionally... Why Why is it a spear if it's, if it's a gun? What, what are you, a fucking... Uh, Go out or whatever the fuck from Starcraft or Stargate or the one of the star ones. Occasionally it can also throw an energy javelin. Oh, it's anime. That inflicts blindness on all struck by it. Very difficult opponent and best avoided in large groups. Why? It has no penetration, barely any magic penetration. No damage at whatsoever. Well, not much. It's air damage. 
Oh, look at this. Anything but air. Easy target. They got air driven. 50 air damage. Immobilize for 4 seconds. But that's just immobilize. Ranged characters won't care about this. The magic reflect. 15% of direct magical damage from the skills vector caster. Does not affect summons or damage over time. So, we again don't care about this either. And it's also 15%. Get out of here. Get out of here. Got to the chopper. Something awoke inside me that day, something sinister. It was the lying part of my brain activated for the first time. It was the day when I first poured gas and then lit it at the same time. Wait, you're lighting it as you're pouring it? Uh, that's pretty dangerous to yourself. You should first pour it out. Then once you pour it all out, get to a safe distance, throw the match and just watch it burn. I mean... I'm not really an arsonist or anything, but light it, uh, pouring it with one hand and lighting it with the other that's, uh, at the same time, eh, kind of not the soundest of plans, if if you if you ask me. Elit Mage, another construct used by the ancients in a magic training. This one was used in more advanced training regime. It has a large health and dangerous abilities. Whoa, it does. Uh, able to change the tide of battle whenever they appear. They're gonna get fucked up. Oh, look at that. They have no water. Not much fire to speak of. Earth and air are kind of high. Again, water. Just splash mountain. All of these. like <laughs> Dribbling. Channels a beam of energy leading 15 fire damage per second. Lasts for 20 seconds. That's nothing. Stun bolt. 60 air damage. Target is stunned for force. Okay, that's... I don't like the stun. Honestly, so far these Destructoids are kind of nasty. Like, with their extreme physical. And again, these meta these magical, me mechanical mages with the uh, Vicious Flame. That's not a lot of fire, but it, it, it stays there forever. And they can just spam that, probably, and just uh, you know, stack it. It probably stacks. If it stacks, it's it can become dangerous. If it doesn't stack, then it's fucking useless. Anyways, kill him. Let's get. Oh wait, I didn't read it. I gotta read the description. So now we gonna. At your service. Yeah, here we go again. Exactly. Stop mansplaining arsonism to me. Sorry. Sorry for mansplaining. Wait, aren't you a man as well? A man cannot mansplain to a man. And then the other man get un upset by the mansplaining man. You can't do that. Mechanical constructs are assaulting your party. Right. Right they are. My blade is yours to command. My blade is yours to command. <laughs> That's the guy you thought was Homer Simpson. Skill cooldown minus, <laughs> minus 50%. Nice, and skill damage plus 25. Damn, Splash Mountain is real. We're gonna absolutely pee pee poo poo on the enemy. We're gonna pee pee poo poo on their soul. Affirmative. Affirmative. Look at that. That guy is just. Ass catch him. Bing bong. Just gonna stand here. Yes. Put our My lord. This guy's gonna put a wall sir. up here. Huh. So they don't even think about coming down here. I'm gonna put the yes, dwarf sir. over here. Money nata. Put money nata. Money nata can actually stay. Uh, come I back. Mean, actually, uh, it was perfect yes, where he was. Go back there. Right between Ranger the girl can come here, and you asshole put, in, put yourself in the wall, in the doorway there. Actually, he can go in the doorway here. Advancing. Yes, that is our perfect plan. And look, he can he can do another one. Unleash hell. Orders. Orders. Look, that's a destructoid. Kill it. Never mind. It just died on its own. Oh, because the traps activated and then they just got blasted. This damn was Money Marte. Oh my god, that's how far they spun? 
more boys down there. I love the summon, man. Look at this. They're getting hurt for one damage. I don't know what's happening here. Oh, look at these. Oh, they're getting Splash Mountain! <laughs> look at that, bam! One more punchy punch. They look kind of cool. Oh, actually, you don't... No, they don't, they don't look cool. So that's supposed to be like a... Like these fiery eyes, these ghostly things, but it's just a flat... It's like cardboard inside. <laughs> it's, just a, it's just a picture <laughs> put in there. I like the color on their uh, armor though, that's nice. And this back here, this reminds me of, of the, uh, the the troll net on the boat in, in Dredge. That's a good game. Look at that. Look at that guy. That guy has some kind of buff on it. It's probably ranging or something. Oh, man. Oh, my God. <laughs> I love it. Look, that guy is like one health point left. <laughs> and he doesn't care, though. He's cool. Look, let's make another one. Bam. Four, four water elementals. Two ants. I'm about to make it three. Bam, son. Oh, one just died. Okay, I can keep up two at the same time. Like four water elementals. Oh, there's three now. Guess what? There's four now. That's beautiful. Oh, there's this. These guys are doing something. My blade is yours to command. Yeah, we don't really, don't really care about what happens to Khan. Eh? He just doesn't care. Look, he dealt 7,000 damage. He, he barely did anything. And look at these guys, 18,700 damage on the fucking water elementals, 9,000 on the ends. Uh, dude, Eric. Eric is MVP. I mean, actually, all four of them are pretty good at what they do. Pretty good. Better weight gold leather of virility. Ooh, virility. I'm gonna make a lot of babies now. Baby making. I don't understand when you don't say Pizza Tower in the title. Or why you didn't say Pizza Tower? Because it's not Pizza Tower, it's Tower Time. Pizza Tower wouldn't really make much sense. The game's called Tower of Time, so it's not Pizza Time, it's Tower of Time. I mean, sure, I see why I would have, I could have said Pizza Tower, but it doesn't look like a Pizza Tower. It has no mention of pizza anywhere. I wouldn't have been bad, but mine's better. <laughs> There's another lever here. And a puzzle. Oh, what the hell is that? Can you look at this contraption? What a beauty. I make a fine time for one of my sons. Oh, this guy has sons. Takes a vivid imagination needed to envision this machine as a toy. Regardless, it's clearly in a non-working state. Light is a form of energy. Perhaps we can get all four blocks illuminated. The machine will activate itself. What machine? It's a dude floating. I like the way you're thinking, mistress. Do you think they are connected to those levers we fixed earlier? We should try to get them all going. Great. Fixed earlier. You must. I must say, you dwarves have a strange way of assessing things. How can you fix something if you don't know what it does and how it works? Good point, noble elf, but in matters of machinery, I gladly yield judgment to Rakim. I don't see any harm in getting those machines running. If you're able, and who knows, maybe they'll help us elsewhere in the tower. Maybe they will free the wisp. Well, we pulled that one, now we go back and pull the previous one, because we need to now. Great. Oh wait, we just pulled it. Oh, so they didn't know what it does, but they left it on green. Okay, that's good. I didn't really qu catch on to the fact that, you know, they actually... Didn't leave it in the way they found it. They left it in an altered state. So lately you've been all over the place. You want to play a GTA mod, but you want to play Splinter Cell at the same time? I mean, you could do it at the same time. 
You also want to play Half-Life mods? Still haven't beaten Ultra Kill, which is... I don't know what Ultra... Is that a mod for Half-Life? Probably, maybe. Halfway through it in the current version? Well, finish it first, man. What the hell? You start playing all these things at the same time. At some point you will not know what the hell you want to do with your life. Master Engineer Boots. Oh, that looks ridiculous. But it's tier 3? It's probably for Rakim. No, it's not. It's for Maeve or Bonon. What? What? Minus 2% resistances on earth and water. Well, that's nasty. Not a lot of health, some movement speed. Oh, 25%. Oh, it has winked shoes on it. And it gives speed. That is so cool. Wow, it gave me nine purple. What the hell? That's actually pretty dope. What is this thing? Oh yeah, that's the thing we got from the fight. And it is... It gives 6% attack speed. It gives positive movement speed. It does have an enchant slot, so we could put the elemental aura on it. Less health, but it gives 6% health, so that's better. Less armor and less resistances, but who cares about that, am I right? No one cares. 3% attack speed it is. Whoa, baby. So much increase. Oh yeah. She doesn't need that armor and that resistances. Yeah, she doesn't need it. Actually, let's not break that yet. What do you have, Boron? Oh, the Frost Vest. I like the Frost Vest. Sounds cool to say. Frost Vest. Yeah. Boron has 10.5 movement speed? What is he smoking? And now my F has 9.4. Damn, son. Some messed up shit right there. Cheese star, man. Should I? Nah. Fine. Just keep it on the elemental resistance. Yeah, all gold is 44 on this floor. Nice. It's okay, it's a great boomer shooter. Not a Half Life mod, though. Oh, wait. I bet as soon as I look it up, I'll know what you're talking about based on the pictures. Based on the pictures? I can say that... Ah, yes. Ah, actually, no. No! This is one of those newer boomer shooters I haven't seen. Ah, you got me. You got to me, I didn't see. I haven't seen this. That looks... That looks okay, look-wise. It's this, uh... Kind of like Voxel graphics or whatever. Holding a blue skull in one hand and have a gun in the other hand, some kind of eyeless creature with a giant, giant mouth and big teeth running at this guy. Ooh, spoopy. Brutal, a fresh weapon bonus. Ultra kill, plus interruption, ricochet, multi kill times 7, limp hit, multi kill times 6, multiplier times 1.34, fresh weapon bonus, almost full. So I guess the more. The more murder you do in the short span of time, you get like combos and you can increase your stuff and you can you get new weapons. Oh there's a skeleton man running at the guy in this picture. And there's some kind of weird robot. Anarchic. It's the swords machine. Alright, sure. That's fun. I have a couple of these boomer shooters put on my watch list but I a lot you know what was the last boomer shooter I played it was fucking the heretic <laughs> uh, that's it that's all that's the last one I played oh my god I read too many hell yeah and we got some more pants loonies for 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 the, the soldier man tier three constructs god damn son of a crack pipe your Pikachu face that you haven't seen it, it's one of the most popular indie games nowadays. But you know what I do nowadays? Well, the same thing I've done before. I play some War Thunders, I play some Warframe, I finish the Dredge, 
I had such a good time with it. I'm playing some Valheim nowadays. Uh, I like the I like the boating in Valheim. It's like playing Windbound but slower. Um, yeah, yeah. And I'm playing this. I don't have time for another game. Anyways, nice armor on this one. Resistances are the same, except air resistance, but I think the air resistance has been tempered on this one, right? No, it was the armor. Mm, interesting. It's got thorns too, and this one is green, so I can't put thorns on it until I forge it. I mean, I don't really have anything else I want to forge right now. Maybe this blue, although it's tier 2 and we are getting tier 3s now. I don't want to forge tier 2s anymore. Uh, what, do we have, what do we have that could be beneficial Beneficial to forge it? It's also tier 2 and it looks like we can craft this. Any tier 2 we can craft, yeah. That is already yellow. Oh no, it's the bow I want to thingy. Yeah, this is what I ended on last time. I broke her previous bow, and she got this crossbow because it gives 10% more crit chance and like one more damage. <laughs> and I put armor penetration on it, so it has the same or more armor penetration. Yeah. Also gives six health per, per hit. That's pretty cool. She doesn't really need it, but it's cool. Yeah, this is the one I'm going to forge. Uh, Plus, forging this green would only turn it into a blue. It needs double forge to get it into an enchant. So we're not going to use it on him, even though it has good armor. It's not good enough for removing one of the thorns. So Rakem might use it. Play some War of Time. Play some War <laughs> Warheim. <laughs> yeah, right. Things have war in their name. It's kind of silly. But oh well. Not as silly as Soul Frame, which is a new game, upcoming game from DE, the creators of uh, Warframe and other other fun stuff, just as uh, I think Darkness 2 and uh, uh, that game where you have that that weird infested arm and it, a lot of stuff came from that game to make Warframe. Uh, nice stuff, but the title. Soul Frame is such a stupid title. I can't fucking put myself uh, over that. Anyways. Nice armor. Shit resistances. Better penetration by one. And magic penetration. More health. More health. It's basically an upgrade. A downgrade in movement speed and a downgrade in resistances. But an upgrade everywhere else. He loses the mana per second. Does he need it? Nah. He doesn't need it. Fuck that. We can forge it too. We can put movement speed on it. Actually, we can't. Why can't we? It's It should be its own thing. Like, I know that the armor and magic penetration is probably one stat, but the construct part is the movement speed. I don't... Or maybe it increases health points or something. Uh, although we can increase health points. I don't know why sometimes this doesn't work. Could put some resis on this thing. Huh? See, his resis don't change. Oh, because this has the same resistances. It's tier through, tier two. Uh, so this is still better. Actually, what what are his resistances? They are good enough. We don't need to forge resistances on this. Maybe a little bit of armor. A little bit of life. Just a little bit of extra stuff. For the armor, he still gets penetrated easy by those destructo bots, but... He's got 22 armor penetration, which is pretty good now. I like that. That's nice. Can I increase armor penetration on this? No. He's still wearing a tier 1, he's wearing the Lord's Blade. What the fuck? Why? <laughs> Play some Soul War? No. 
I mean, I will once it comes out. Probably next year, maybe the year after that. I already signed up. I mean, come on, what the hell? What did he heal? What did he heal, man? Good. Yeah, everything is 44 on this. Officer's handbook, and that looks like a door, maybe? No, it's just pistons or some shit. So we got the laser puzzle, apparently. There's a warning, though. Warning! Staring directly into the photon pylon may cause permanent damage. Please manipulate with caution and beware of nearby individuals. Nah. Whoa, it's Photon Pylon. I can't rotate this one. Uh, it's probably the these things bring the pylon towers online, so we need one more lever to be able to rotate this boy. So let's keep running around like crazy people. A lot of these mechanical trees everywhere. I love this this very, very chill music that doesn't fit at all. Officer's Handbook. So play some poor man <laughs> Absolution. Do you want me to play Hitman Absolution again? Maybe on a harder difficulty? <laughs> I'm not touching that game ever again, I'm sorry. It was fun, but it's not replay fun. Uh, replay it immediately fun, you know. Want you to play Hitman 2? I don't have it! And I don't care. I have enough shit to play. I can't even go through them. <laughs> An oddly clean book. Quest with a polished silver hinge lies on the table before your champions. Most of the pages have been torn, but but the introduction is <gasps> legible. But it, in, instead they used intact. Ah, they're learning. Since the great incident, the world has been in turmoil without the political and logistical influence of the tower. Society fragmented in a single decade. Rumors circulate among those of us absent from the tower when it happened. Ambassadors and their staffs, field agents and so forth. But we all know it was Proteus' is doing. Who else could channel the power necessary to grant the earth and thrust the entire tower underground? Oh, he basically fucked the entire planet. Uh, no, the question is not who did it. But why was it done? The senior ranked among us, among us survivors. Those who knew the power of struggles at the top of the tower speak of the Argante threat. Oh yeah, so maybe the Argante are not the Deva. And the schism that it caused on High Council. Our efforts to locate the tower underground finally bear fruit. Preparations are on the way to reach the top of the subverted structure, structure and find out exactly what happened what needs to be or what can be done at this point. This is a time of great anxiety, as no one is certain what awaits us. Was Proteus' action a last desperate resource to a tower overrun with constructs? Or worse yet, could the Organthe themselves have finally broken through? While well, nerves are high, we work diligently to maintain the chain of command and some measure of order. Magi the, and the experienced explorers have taken positions of authority within the expedition. We are likely to afford one only one single chance to penetrate the tower and unravel the mystery. The following text is intended to serve as an organizational framework outlining the roles and responsibilities of the established command hierarchy as well as protocols for enforcing discipline. Right? This is a very read heavy game. This is a powerful memory for something imprinted on such fragile material. It seems an expedition of survivors returned to the tower right along the da 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 great looks up. Yeah, we just read it. We don't need you to fucking tell us what we read, fucker. Command center, unfortunately, seems the expedition failed. A loss might be our gain. We left some money behind. All right, going. All right, Bob. Have fun figuring out what to do with your playtime. Watch out not to let your social credit score drop too much. Bum, bum, bum. Where could the last lever be? If the last... Oh, I see it. It's up there. Let's check this door. Installation manual. What machine has been installed? Default password is 1111. Remember to change it. Ah, this might be the... The one... The 0180, right? Something. Just 
doing donating some spare kidneys. Oh, I'll just donate some spare kidneys. Yeah, that will increase your credit score. Old typing device. How frustrating and under the den. This place reminds me of the endless fortress forests back home, except without the mathematical certainties of time portals. Clearly defined currents of life spark, sure. Pardon me, I forget not all races are gifted with elven side. Wow, he's being racist again. God damn it, everybody's racist here. Maybe Rockham is the least racist one, but he's just stupid, so whatever. <laughs> he's a dwarf. Our eyes are able to see the life energy emitted by all living things. In the endless forests, these energies create distinct visual currents. So basically, they smell each other's life. Ew. Tell us, forest mage, what do you elven eyes make of the strange panel on the wall? The circle of things covered in letters and numbers must have a purpose. He's gonna smell the fingerprints on the on the numbers. Hmm, I bet my axe is related to the door somehow, but its workings are beyond my understanding. Haha, <laughs> you don't have an axe anymore. You have a hammer. I concur with the rune lord. The ice goes where the river flows. I'm such a moron, her. The big skin speak common tongue for a change. We are not able to open this door without help. Maybe the same device somewhere. Touch. Touch. Man, how will I ever open the door? The door seems to have neither a keyhole nor a handle. I mean, if you try enough, anything can be a keyhole. Can't even be opened by force, perhaps there's another way. Look at that, something is dangling there. The tower is becoming sexual. Sexual tower. Lesser school. Another speed. Oh. <laughs> no. It's only giving her one percent at this point. Yeah, she's she's nearing twenty-five. She's nearing completion. Once we reach level or plus one hundred percent. It's point four attacks per second. She almost attacks every other seconds. Almost. Not quite. Quiet relic chest, give me your secrets. Oh, pop, pop. Ooh, tier 3, 2, oh, 3 green. Well, actually, this would give us 3, right? Because they give 1 for each tier. That's a lot of green, suddenly. And a bunch of money. I'm gonna accept this, because this gloves might be good. It's a gloves for her. It's trash. Skill power increase. Yeah, it's trash. She's got crit chance on this baby. We get a 12% crit chance. We're not giving that up. Alright, let's reload. Because the reload times are fast. I want to see if... Since the gold piles are not random anymore. They're just static 44. I want to see if chests can still be rerolled. And they still can. Okay, the same amount of money. Two blue crystals. Mm, but we got a hammer. Two-handed. It's a better DPS hammer, it has better physical, loses the earth, gains 1% stun, 10% extra cleavage, same penetration, better health per hit, damn, but it doesn't have the enchant slot and it's green. Uh, everything else is the same or better. Most of the things are better, but I mean, not by much. That bleed... 40% of the damage is like an extra fucking 5-10 damage, depending on the enemy's armor, right? Although it igno actually it ignores armor, so... Mm -hmm. What can I put on this? Cleavage? We can increase cleavage by 28%. But honestly, I kind of use him as a tank as well, so he doesn't... We can keep rolling because it looks like this chest is giving us tier 3, so we can maybe find some pretty cool tier 3 chest armor for this guy, or tier 3 gloves, helmet, amulet, weapons, something. You know, we can just roll this chest for eternity. Oh my god! Less money a little bit, but we got a blue tier 3 two handed crossbow. Oh wow. Vampiric Obsidian Crossbow Void, so it deals more physical, same attack speed, extra void damage, less penetration, more health per hit, less crit- ah, I see. 
That's very wrong. Oh, it's either... What do I increase? So 1644. 1232. So I could make it 16 armor pen with just one upgrade. But we kind of need both upgrades. And even then it would only be 40% instead of 44%. See, when it comes to critical chance on this lady, I need to be really particular. It's a lot of extra DPS, but... Roll it again. I just want to see the things that we can get. Ooh, it's a wand. No, it's, it's, it's a hammer. A one-handed hammer. Obsidian hammer. It's chaotic. And barely more than a hundred gold. Oh, a purple, a blue, a blue tier three robe. It's a robe though, so it's probably not going to be used. Because we have the crazed mage robe, which is amazing. It's a health robe. It's a defense robe, dude. What the hell? Okay, one last rolling. Yeah, okay, cool. It's the last roll, and it looks promising. It's green, but it's tier 3. Actually, the gargoyle skin is tier 3 as well, and we got it... Not in the previous floor, but the one before it. I didn't even realize it was tier 3. Damn. Oh, it's gold plate. Yeah, gold is the other, and this is obsidian. So, gargoyle skin is better. But this one is, ooh, okay, better, better, got penetration, nice. Magic pen is also good for him because of its fire stuff. Less health, more health regen, minus two life, I mean, sure, he loses like 41 HP, but he's got 7.3 regen. Instead of the 6.6. .6. That is so cool. Goodbye, Lord's Plate. You've served us well from the start of the game. That is pretty dope. And we can also just enchant a bunch of garbage on it. We can enchant it with more resistances, health and armor, regen. We won't because don't care about it. Don't care about wasting stuff on it. I'd rather try and craft a, a blue or a purple with these gems instead of putting them into this. It's very generic, honestly. Greater resistance, that's why it has more resistances, that's okay. Pretty cool. Nice upgrade, nice upgrade, we can continue. Oh shit, it's another door! Let me check this door. Let me inspect the door and frame... Door frame! Oh my god, it's the new game from Digital Extremes, door frame. Fuck! He finds no luck, so he pulls out his axe and swings at the door mightily. Oh, he's trying to say the n-word. Uh, the door wins for now. Okay, he didn't say it. That's good, good. Fucking... He's turning racist. I, I see now. This group is turning this guy racist. Heavy steel door. The door seems to have... Neither a keyhole or a handle. Blah, blah, blah. It's another... Oh, wait. There's the lever. Hook on technomancy. Ooh. All the shelves filled the ruined tomes of various designs. One oversized book in particular. Draws your champion's gaze. Dusting of the cover, a golden boss title reads First Principles of Trechnomancy. Trechnomancy. Complicated diagrams and long passages about combat strategy fill the volume. After a quick glance, the champions turn back the tide of the murder. Many of the High Council look uh, on the new school of magic. <laughs> what the fuck is that word? Askens? Like in question? Skins. What are these archaic looking words? Ah. We doubt. They have, they have the doubts about it. They're like, ah. Ah. they're giving it the stink eye. They're like, ah. what is this technomancy? Back in my day, we didn't have techno, we, did, we only had necro. <laughs> They do not see its true potential, nor do they recognize the power of our technological heritage. Their outlooks are skewed, seeing only how magic led to a dilapidated infrastructure. I love that word. 
Planes which no longer fly, trains derailed and rusting, and other technological marvels, transportation all rendered useless since the invention of teleport crystals. <sighs> Lazy. What is this, Wally? The beginning? History will record that the technological technical knowledge of our forebears is not yet and should never be lost. Technology can be fused with our new knowledge of modern magic yielding artifacts which neither magic nor technology can alone can yield. Fuse them, why not both? Great Magus can summon forth th and throw gobs of flame at an enemy. Burning goblins, what? But in time, even the greatest Magus depletes his modern tires. In contrast, a simple soldier can fire enchanted pistol bullets with little effort as long as his physical supplies last. And once they deplete, they can just summon more bullets. Yeah! And drink some Gatorade, then run. Fascinating. I bet half my wealth, the author of this tome was a dwarf. Nonsense. Dwarves are miners, masters at the craft, to be sure, but simple miners nonetheless. Wow, racism. The trading of magic and artifice is surely an elven art. Simple. Why, only enough. Enough! And this constant bickering over nothing must cease at once. It's not helping us get anywhere. Okay. At the author's name on the spine. Elolia Arsalmis. Lolly. Ha! This one was neither elf nor dwarf. Just one of my people. A shadow. Thank you for shedding that, your highness. Shuttling. Great, just pull the fucking lever. Another mysterious lever, champions. Leave it on the on position. This was one of the last three levers required to activate. We can do the power pylon puzzle. Hmm. What will the power pylon puzzle net us? We will never know. Until we do it. Turn the pylon. Puzzle time. Solved. Easy. Alright. That's a golem man. He's alive! He's cute! Look at him! Oh, look! He's it's, it's our party member now. Repaired machine. Maintenance unit. Everything instructions. It speaks. We fixed it. That which works and toils with endless designs, it dares dream to be free. Mm, I don't think it's an AI. <laughs> Indeed, our world <laughs> has lost so much since the ancient times. If we once had no knowledge to create life itself, can you understand us, machine? Comprehension, 100%, mate. Do you have a name? Yes. Well, no, it's not well. It's Wilbert. Oh, great. I see where this is going. Game Machine, what's your name? Resignation. Okay, okay, we got it. She threw up her own hands? Why would she eat them in the first place? What is wrong with you, my? You need them for bow stuff. What a horrendous name for such a beautiful construction. She'll call you differently. Differently. Ah, I know. Call you shiny. Shiny? Dude, now you're speaking my language. Arr, somehow I don't think that is quite fitting either, Rockham. Besides, this thing holds little beauty. Beauty is in the eye of the beholder, but okay. There's a random merge of metal and crystal. Exactly. It's adorable. Certainly have seen fair things in my life. Oh. He's constantly hitting on, on women, except Shadow, because Shadow doesn't have a face. And she got tits, I mean, come on, Kane. Are you racist towards Shadows, I guess? Ah, oh, lady, I guess beauty's in diet for beholder, as they say, but if you insist, you call it something else. What about it, Dave, Kit, Johnny Five, Mech, yes, Mech, short and lovely, perfect. How did he come to the conclusion of mech? Is it mechanism? Because, uh, I guess... Machine, your name is now mech. Do you understand? Comprehension 100%. I am now mech. Ah, uh, exactly you do. I do air tower, mech. Serve and obey. System maintenance. Clearance level 2B. 
to be is that that game with the blindfolded chick in the uh, lingerie or something huh. so you fix things yes wait a minute controlled by the tower well it seems that it stopped working maybe it's power source is malfunctioning too bad I kind of like the idea of having a little helper who could fix things in this crazy place. Great spirit snow, we could use the help. Smirking. How do we know? What did I say? When you question this construct, you told it to wait a minute. Did she? Yeah, oh, that's right. It, oh, it follows instructions to the letter. Amazing, a machine made to understand language and make independent decisions. Not a drop of mana anywhere in its design. Whoever saw, whoever oversaw the level of tower must have been masters of craftsmen beyond all comprehension of the world. More than a minute has passed. Let us if, see if Whisper is correct. Master Smith, if you will be so kind to tell the construct to join our ranks. Mac, are you with us? Mac is here. You are here. Affirmative. Mac is with you. All right, then, you beautiful piece of metal. Looks like you're with us. Falling behind, we're on our way to the bottom of this tower. Oh, you command Mac obeys. Mac is active. Is that the last character? That doesn't look like its picture. It's not a lady. Unless it's a lady. I mean... It's cute. Oh, it's not the Mac! I cannot use the Mac. What? Mac is definitely going to die somewhere then. I hope it fights with, alongside us. Alright, so it didn't really lead us anywhere unless it can open doors. Alright, Mac, open this door for us. Mac Alec. Ha <laughs> I jest. Open the door, pussy. Maybe a friend can be of assistance. Mac, can you open this door? Yes. Well. Yes, Mac is well. Thank you for your qu query. Dude, tell him to open the door. These assholes, these racist assholes do not learn. Takes some getting used to, but I think I have a hang of this now. Remember the little guy understands precision instruction. If you didn't tell him, they Mac, open the door. Unable to comply. Mac processing power inadequate. Processing power? Apparently its energy source is repeated, though I know not what it means by processing. Need to juice it up! Ju 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 juice it up. Can you open this other door? Nah, it cannot. This music is putting me to sleep. I should really switch to something else. But I'm lazy, <laughs> and I don't have anything in mind. Some kind of fucking piano. Construct! Can you do something about the light in here? Hello, Construct, do you hear me? Its name is Mech, not Construct. <laughs> you stupid fuck. Connie, I think you will need to address it by its name. Really, my ever your authority on Constructs now? Mac, can you turn on the lights here? My torch does not provide adequate light. Also, we will never understand where he got this torch from. He's just kind of swapped from a wooden torch that's burning to just this Technomancer's torch. Affirmative, please stand by. Beep boop. And he runs off, and we will never see him again. Great, well done, shield guard. What if the controls of the lights are somewhere deep below, no longer operable? He might. Not ever see the thing ever. Well, um, uh, I have faith in our little friend. Oh, it's back. <gasps> the lights are on. Wow. Whoa. Oh, it's back. Level illumination restored. Thank you for your patience. Ah. Well done, Mac. Cool. No more emergency lighting. There's nothing new, but now it's very bright in here. Oh, crap. Da -da -da -da. That's the way back to the beginning. 
mechanics of the tower. What the hell is that thing? It's pumping away. Ooh. They're slightly out of sync. Uh, look at that. And they're getting more out of sync as we look at them. Oh, four are out of sync. Actually, these two might not be. But these... these oh my god. No, it hurts my eyes. Mechanics of the Tower. The title of one of the books catches your eye. Mechanics of the Tower. Much of the tome lies in ruin. Few intact pages present obscure details concerning architectural elements and complex engineering formulas. You mean formulae? What? During the champion's brief review, one page does stand out. No longer invincible, the sources of its power are cut one by one. It retreats into the artifact. It is essential that the first source in its roost must originate furthest from the Titan's base. Titan? Only the source bears the initiating couplet of the spell. Note that priming the artifact that houses the Titan will not reawaken if... Or re not reawaken it. Some kind of Titan? Are we talking about the, the boss of this level? The boss of this gym? I'm still waiting for an ambush. Hello, ambush me. There's a broken mech. Oh, this guy. Oh, it's like him, but larger. It's like the dude from uh, Big Hero 6. It's got that far sitting eyes, big bubbly body. Oh, it's dead. <laughs> its machine tremble resembles one following us. I does. What are these little black things that adorn it? R rabbit shit. <laughs> Mac. Mac doesn't have such trinkets. Exquisite detail. I wonder if they are aesthetic or functional. To ends that escape us. Or, oh, yeah. Processor chips. Increase processing speed. Insert to upgrade. Oh, we need to insert. What do you mean, Mac? Insert where? Up my bum. Rear cell. <laughs> it is his bum. Re second the report. In slot below my head. Oh. There you go, laddie. That should do it. System restart, please stand by. Upgrade complete, thank you. I feel like my old self again. I would like to give a piece of my mind to whomever swapped my original chipset for an old guard processor. You say you Mac, you sound different. The increases my in my processor power has allowed me to reinstall my sentience programming and restore previous memory files. My current capabilities will also now allow me to operate the machinery on this level. Just need to get its generator. Get to its generator. Generator? Generator, noun. A thing generates something, in particular, in this case, power to control the diner relays that control the access points. If you wish to proceed to the floor floor, I must repair the main generator. I assume this is why I was reactivated. Nah, we just kind of do it. did it for funsies. Excellent! We did not reactivate you only for these means, mech. But your help in this matter will be most appreciated. Let's get to it. Let's go reactivate some shit. After we touch some chests. Wait, the chest is on the other side! What is this though? Master Engineer Cap. Whoa, Viking Cap for the Dwarf. Dwarf Cap. Oh, it's... I don't understand why it's not heavy armor. The dwarf is the engineer man, and these fucking things are for for these idiots. Why would my have have the engineer stuff? Or this guy, he's a fucking historian. This one is a thief. What? Not to mention that the gloves were or the the boots were absolute garbage. Let's see this then. Ten percent fire resistance and ten percent air resistance. Health points, movement speed, so far so bad. Skill power increase 2%. Critical chance 15%. Oh, gives to speed. Ooh, true sight. Increase crit chance by 15. I see, I see. I see, I see, I see. We lose 20% magic penetration. Also, oh no, not 20. 3%. Alright. We lose a lot of armor pen. 83% crit chance, plus the 18% from our buff, puts us above 100%. 
critical chance. It's 101% crit chance. So why this is on, and the skill is on, with its current level, we just crit every shot. I wonder if it has double crits, like in Warframe, double, triple, so, so on and so forth. But I mean, 101%, 1% chance for a double crit, nyeh, nyeh, doesn't really matter. But guaranteed crits, as long as her, what's my call it, fire arrows are up. And they last 40 seconds. Yes. Why would anyone ever use the fucking explosive projectiles? Just gives it explosion radius. Who cares? Crits, dude. So much better. However. What does she lose? So she loses 7 armor penetration. Eh. That's basically the only thing I don't want to lose. She gains plus two speed. Oh. Done. I, I don't care about this cap. This cap can go on this guy because it's basically a direct upgrade. Yep. Cool beans. Pretty good. So now she needs more armor penetration. I think after we forge this, it gets one more forge slot, so I can put another armor penetration on it. It's gonna be an extra four armor penetration that we kind of need now. What else could get armor pen? Can you get armor pen? No. Can you get armor pen? No. Why would they? They don't have any armor pen on them. That the suck, sir. That's okay. We have guaranteed crits with fire arrows, and fire arrows will be upgraded later. I mean, I definitely want to max this out. Level 12. So that's, I think it's another 6% because they give 3% every, every time. Yeah. This gives 12 and this just gives 3 and 3. So another 6%. It's gonna be nice. Which means we can tailor our uh, critical chance things accordingly. Very nice. Where do we go now though? Oh, now we can open the door. But there's still one more thing on this corner. Near these pumping machines that pump endlessly. Mm, they pump. They pump the good stuff. Table with scattered books. Simple looking table with ordinary commonplace books of the time. A magazine's guide to penmanship. The best places to eat in Artara and horse breeding for beginners. Uh, okay. Oh, I see some cool looking stuff in the background. Giant staircase that leads to Blight Town. Very nice. Welcome to Blight Town. Enjoy your suffering. Right. Empty crates. Empty Vamid Crete's constructed of black oak, craftsmanship far beyond anything you can buy today, all empty. Do these gears even touch properly? I don't think these gears... Dude, they don't even touch! They barely don't touch. I mean, that, that one kind of touches, but like more like clips into it. But not all of them. Wait, what? That one clips in. That a little bit. But these ones don't touch. It's not even center! Bruh! Who made this gear things? Did they think no one would look at it and scrutinize? Ah. Gears. Table with scattered shit. Plain looking table, a handful of mundane books, two works of fiction, and a report on the construction materials used during the creation of the tower. Nothing particular in interest. Steel door. Opening the door. Please wait. The door is open now. Ah, he appeared it was a piece of metal. Oh, he doubled it. Yeah, like opened both at the same time. Oh, it's a secret area. Ooh, okay. Plus 0.2 mana regeneration per second. Mm, 
It is said that the highest ranks of Elven Druid Order could replenish their mana as quickly as they could spend it in hurling their spells of healing. However, all would be wise to heed the old saying, when mana depletes, the wise man retreats. Point to mana region. And I'm not giving it to him. He's okay. Rakem is alright-ish. This guy is no mana region. But he doesn't really need it. He can dash like six times. Yeah. I mean, his heal is 40. Uh, uh. gets the point two. She's on three now. That's pretty good. She's still gonna run herself dry with this. This also eats 50 and the bear traps is the stuff she kind of spams. This also costs 50. Fifth. Why is it not upgraded? Oh, because it doesn't really need upgrade. Yeah, that's fine. It's fine. Then again, Blind for 4 seconds, or 5 seconds, doesn't really matter. So let's put the Hunter's Mark on. Slows things so they can't really leave the area, or larger area? Let's go with larger area. It looks a little nicer here. This looks very derpy. Oh, this looks cool, though. <sighs> yeah, I'm basically choosing based on the, the icon. Yeah, this looks cooler. Because if something evades the bear traps and is, and is barreling towards the, the uh, v-cline. You can put this on them to slow them a little bit down, you know. Yeah, it's okay. Chest. Tier 2 plus. We just got a good... So, I kind of want to re-roll that. <laughs> oh no, they put the ambush on a chest opening. Oh, what is this? Frenzied War Gloves of Anxiety. Ooh, we have something similar on Eric, but it has more forge slots. I don't think it has enchant. All right, so if I open the inventory really quickly, I can just look at this, so that's nice. So, yeah, it's literally the same thing, but look at that cooldown, 41%, 14%, eh, and this gives 10 crit. So that's 15% over there, because, yeah, yeah, look at that, it has 4 times, 4 times 3, so that's 12%. So it would have 9% less cooldown, but it would give 10% more crit chance. Now, crit chance does apply to his skill, to his ice cloud. It doesn't apply to the uh, splash mounted or the forest people. Does work with ice cloud. It's got 30% crit chance. But this has got 40! 9% less cooldown. Ah, oh, 62% though. Although it's easier to count with 50%. But... I like that 40% crit chance. He will keep it. And she will inherit this. It's a defensive glove that she has on, which is garbage. Defensive glove, but it's, it's also the Saints. So it lowers her... And she gets skill power, but that 41% cooldown, oh yeah. If we ever use her in combat. Oh, that's dangerous. The icon doesn't change. Alright, let's fight. Auto cutter, blah blah blah, same shit. 
Champions have been trapped. Free them before remaining champions are overrun by the enemy forces. Who's got trapped? Yes. Shit, the damage got trapped and they're so far away! Yes, moving. <gasps> we got the robot. VD40! <laughs> Ah, uh, that's funny. That's an actual product. It's gonna make everything go smoothly and well oiled. Although that's not... Isn't it 40? Or 30? I don't know. It has no damage, no life, no nothing. It's, it's gonna... What happens when it dies? Oh. How may I help you? You gotta go at that thing. I don't know who this follows. Maybe it just goes on its own. That's not cool. Oh look, it's it's got some kind of aura around it. That's cool. At your service. Ha! Up. Gotta get this cage out of here. Burn all your mana on it if you have to. Creatures of the night. Affirmative. All right. Okay, it has its own yes, mind. Sir. Hello? Yes. Can I select them? All right. No one is attacking him. Money Marte, watch out! Brr. Save. I'm gonna have to do this without my aim. Let's summon one of those guys. Yes, to be into position. Be a uh, thing. Yes, Right. I'm a lord. Oh, you you gotta handle handle this guy. We. She's free! I never She's ready to kill everything that called her hostage ever in her entire life. Heru Amin. Yes. At once, sire. Manka. Anka. They're getting split up so I hard. My blade you know what? Come back command. here. Actually, you don't need to come back here. Just kill this weird ass. Dude. Hello? I not want to kill him? No, he's immobilized! What will I ever do? My Lord? This guy's going to stand in yes, the doorway really. right here. Maninata. Maninata is going to give us some monka. On my way. Both of you can just Uma come here. Dela. Yes, my lord. Acknowledged. Slowed and weakened. Thorns and murdered. Easy. Shoot them. I never miss. This place looks kinda cool. Look at that. We got a crystals down below and there's even deeper level there. This looks cool. Let's appreciate the the arena a little bit. I like this. Again, this is the basically the factory with the little park, but it has more crystals around. Look at that. That's kind of dope. I like what they've done with these uh, arenas. Look, they got they got the uh, the guy from Nightmare Before Christmas. The uh, the guy that's that's basically a potato sack filled with bugs. The boogeyman. That, that's him, right there. He's gonna give you nightmares. Fun. What did we get from that? Garbage? Ha. <sighs> well, we got money. That's always good. Ah, and this is the other side. This is the door we couldn't open. So that's cool. It's a little short cutting. Broken Mac we touched. Lever we touched. Doors we touched. Everything here we touched. So now we open this door. And we move forward with our lives. 
amazing. Maybe a little friend can be of assistance here. Mac, can you open this door for us? They don't learn. He's gonna say yes, and then we're gonna look at each other, dumbfounded, like, hmm, why is he not doing it? Mac leaves. Wait, what? Oh, because now it, it has upgraded its sentience, so now it knows that when we asked that, it, he also wanted to say yes and also do it at the same time. Ah, the joke was on me, because I forgot. One of its digits splits into a socket on the wall. Ew. As its other hand starts tapping buttons slowly at first, and then at such speed its movements are little more than a blur. After a few moments, there's a silent click in a frame around the door, and it starts humming silently. Wow. Oh. Alright, it's assuming the position for Kane. He's got what he wanted someone to mate with. God machine is working now. Password is required to open the door. Ah, unless he was right, the machine may come in handy after all. Imagine hundreds, no thousands just like him. They could open all the doors. Doors could rebuild the entire world with an army of mechs under our command. By the size of that smile, I don't doubt it, Chief. Not one bit. Beep boop. What do you mean? Did, did what? Oh, maybe it's just default. I never changed the default, so oh, this is not the triangle. We need. Uh, it's, it's, uh, uh, never mind. That's Proteus. Another statue. It seems strangely out of place. I wonder what this one does or what it wants. I really hope that phone dialing sound is not uh, DMCA. People got fucked for. Uh, Police alarm sounds, so eh, you never know. As your champions draw closer, the statue's eyes start to glow with an intense blue light. Faradus, oh, I read Proteus. Oh well. Would have been too easy to see Proteus turn into a goddamn machine tree with a snout. Just kind of dangles. What do you want? Can you not see I am busy? Busy? Doing what exactly? I am Faradus. It is my responsibility to provide power throughout the entire tower. Every light that lights, every hum that hums, whirr that whirs, and ping that pings. They would all be dim and silent without my efforts. I hate to break it to you, pal, but there ain't much humming and buzzing around here anymore. What do you mean? The cable connected to my back feeds the grid onto the entire tower and has done so far before any of you were born. So, if you'll excuse me, great matters demand my attention. Mac looks behind the statue and notices something that demands his attention. And then he goes and fucks it. When the others... I'm so vulgar. When the others look clo closer to see what he's looking at, they see a large black rope running from the button of the statue. Oh, he's not plugged in. Inside the black rope lies a dozen small frayed metal ropes. Oh, he got caught. Like the Protoss when they cut their hair. A small severed portion of the black rope disappears into the tower wall. Parados, the tower no longer functions at full capacity. Your connection to the grid is severed. No! May bends down and picks up the portion of black rope and gets electrocuted to death! Still attached to the wall, Max's eyes go bright and he straightens up with a jerk. Oh, he jerks it off. Can't we just plug him back in or something? Wait, don't touch that! The cable is deadly. Before the construct is finished speaking, Connie yanks my back, ripping the cable from her hand. She glares at him, rubs her arm and walks away, shaking her head. You have fought many battles alongside your trusted friend, yet never have you seen him so rattled. Connected to your champions as you are, you feel Kane's heart racing and the sense of sheer dread washing over Oh no, he was so afraid that Maya might electrocute himself herself to 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 death. Death Oh my god, Kane! What a white knight! I would have watched her kill herself and then I would have laughed. Then I would have been Replacing her corpse with uh, Whisper in the combat party. Easy. Upset and emotional. I know, I know. Oh, how I know. My existence is meaningless. I did not think you would realize. I thought if I acted the part, I could relieve my glory days. But I actually contributed to this great structure. Oh, humiliation. But why were you disconnected in the first place? 
some orcs came by. In the beginning, when the tower was first built, things were simple. Everything served a single purpose. Training of the Magi. However, as the years progressed, training became secondary to more serious research and study. Things that required more and more energy. And then one day, the Technomancers advanced their craft to such an extent that it was no longer needed. Replaced by an unthinking monster generator who fills this entire floor. Don't be glum, lady. I'll have you back up and running in no time. I just need you to reconnect you to back here, I think. Stop! Don't! Don't open the door! The new system is all wrong. If you were reconnected now, it would overload my systems. In a fraction of a second, I would be no more. If only there were something simple for me to power. Then, then my existence would have purpose again. Can you power yourself to shut the fuck up? Haha! <laughs> Found in across the corridor requires power and oversight. Fresh, clean, cool water now flows from the deep, constant like the stars above in the night sky. What better tusk could one ask for? There are some auxiliary wires, trans tri wireless transmitters, wow, behind me. If you can connect one to the fountain at the base, that would be great, but one will not suffice. After so many years, my energy banks are overflowing. You will need to find a second machine for me to power. Imagine a power source like this. It just, it just has more energy than it can contain after thousands of years. It's not just depleted or dead or something. It's like bustling with energy. It's like, please let me power stuff. Like, Holy shit, that's some. And it talks, which is kind of a drawback. But it, eh, it's a sentient dangly bit tower. It's also spraying mist. Cool. It says lava around it. I don't know. Our champions take two transmitters from the back of the statue. Transmitters. Farados. Alright. Let's connect him to a toaster. So hopefully there are only no more. There'll be no more ambushes, so we can just run around. Ooh, a greater scroll. Those have not been particularly useful most of the time. I think I left two and used three, so I guess most of the time they were useful. Let's see. Greater Scroll. Truly Mana has been cursed throughout the generations. When the nodes began to appear around the world, uh, pandemonium soon ensued. Those who thought themselves lucky to be capable of absorbing great volumes of mana were soon this dissuaded this oh disabused oh wow country the beliefs as their families and friends disowned them and they were forced into exile why would we want to lower our mana you stupid shit why why for 30 health i would have to for 30 measly shit ass health i would have to give up one cast of dash almost a cast of mana Actually, it's minus 20 mana, right? Well, not mana, he healing. Yeah, half a cast of healing. Wait a minute. Kronk has no mana. Kronk only knows rage. Not Kronk. Uh, Kratos, but yeah. 67 rage. What if he eats this? Ah! Oh! He can literally not use half of his shit because they cost 50 rage. Wow, so his rage is his mana. So lowering his mana lowers his rage. So that's why his mana fluck or his rage capacity fluctuates because mana increasing items are basically his rage. Which is fucking stupid. But here we are. So no one benefits from that. No one. Until we have enough mana regeneration on the tanky people that they literally can't use up their mana fast enough. That thing is not beneficial. A big boiler. Ooh. These large metal cylinders more resemble barrels. The turntable turnable wheels seem to release steam. The pressure gauges don't work on these larger versions either. Pressure gauge. It's humming at me. Oh, it's a gun! 
Vampiric Rifle Fire Pistol. It's a one-handed gun with fire damage. 13 magic penetra. <laughs> what the fuck? Garbage. Ooh. Mystic Pants. Mystic Pants. Mm. Federate Mr. Pants. The defenses we don't care about. Same movement speed. It, it doesn't have the mana regen. Ah, because the ethereal absorption, of course. And it's green, so it's useless. Because it needs double forging. Tisk, tisk. <gasps> Tier 3 tablet. Earth. Vampiric Moonstone. Ooh. Ah. 13% magic penetration, that's garbage. 4 health per hit, that's pointless. Skill power is 14%, that's trash. However, yeah, 22, 15. Oh, wait, that's uh, 22, 16, 15, because it gives crit as well. 22, 10, 15. And this is 13, 14. Well, wow, that's absolute garbage. Blah, 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 blah. It's Mystic Robe. He's got the uh, Crazy Mage stuff. Whisper doesn't matter. A bow, two-handed. Is it good? It's green. It's four upgrades, but it's still just green. We need that enchant. Faster, with more damage. A lot less penetration. No crit whatsoever. But we can crit it up. So it needs 20% crit, 10 penetration to be as well. And it cannot have that. Right, one more roll. Let's see. Maybe two. It depends. This is for obsidian, so this is a heavy armor, right? No. It's for my... Uh, okay. Good regen, good defense, good resistance, good health. No movement speed, no attack speed, health and mana increase. At 3% attack speed, I don't care about that. Extra 6% mana is not much either. You know what? One more roll. Come on. Come on, loot box. Give me a good roll. Yeah. <laughs> That's uh, an armor, army pants. But it's again green, so it can't have thorns. And he already got a better one. One more roll. Come on. Give me a... I need... I don't even know what I need. I need army boots. Tier 3 army boots is what I need. This game is trolling, you know. 99 money and a two-handed sword. Physical with some air. It's faster, more damage. Better cleavage, no stun. Same penetration, no health per hit. 28 crit, oh wow. Doesn't have the bleeding, but it has the crits. I might use this. 44% crit. And we can put penetration on it, so it can do good. I mean, plus four main damage and plus four penetration is literally the same thing. Additional damage would be, what, air. Air is not particularly good on this floor, so I don't care about that. Pritchens might not be bad. Let's do two armor penetration. Two Pritchens. There. So it doesn't have health back, but it's like six health. And he attacks like once every three seconds. So that six health is nothing. And the obsidian edge was not bad, but now we have more physical damage. Some air which is kinda useless here. Although that earth was kinda useless as well because it's very low. But we we got a heap of more penetration as well, and a lot of crit chance. You know what? I, I, that's fine, I'll take it. Take it over the, uh, the purple hammer. What is this, though? Oh, it's an earth axe. 
I completely forgot about this. Is this good? So on this level, level we need fire and water, right? Earth is decent and air is kind of bad. And since Earth is only decent, we don't really care about this. Skill power increase, which is not penetration, so it's kind of poopy. Magic penetration is 12%. Yeah, this will still... I'll still keep it. Might be useful against something, maybe an air elemental, if I don't forget. But I mean, I did forget in the air uh, arena or area in the previous floor. This guy still has the fire. But it's a decent upgrade. Sure, the blood, bleeding is gone, but the bleeding needs 10 seconds to get all that 40% damage done. So it's 4% per second. And that's not much, because in 3 seconds he attacks again. Which probably just refreshes the bleed duration, doesn't make it stack. So, yeah, it's it's not that interesting, the bleed. It's kind of poopy. Actually, yeah, the four armor penetration or four damage is kind of the same. Because the... Does it add it to the maximum damage or... Oh, just main damage, so it adds it to both the minimum and maximum, yeah, so it's, it's basically the same thing. As I was thinking, with, uh, with low armored enemies, it gives extra damage, that armor penetration. Actually, it doesn't. Can you lower something's armor into negative values? Because I know the resistances can be lowered to negative, but I don't know if the armor works the same way. We got a portal fight. But oh well, it doesn't really matter. Fountain generator. Ooh, turn this on first. We get a chest. Almost. Oh, actually we can get it, I think. Para disconnected to a fountain. Your champions have connected this fountain to the power grid. Waters here are flowing again. We can touch. Oh, we can touch. Nice. How is that chest floating? Full of garbage, money and other garbage. And it's full. Blue pants. Blue T3. One forge and we can put thorns on it. But the armor is garbage, although we can increase it. It has two slots. It's got some movement speed on it. Dude, I need that. It's even less life though. Ay, 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 ay. Oh, this is these are these would be so good for Mr. Man. Sadly they are green, and not a lot of forge options are available. And I would rather forge this, so I can get the extra 20% on it. So she can become a murder machine again. Ah! Nay. I don't, I'm not gonna forge this. It's gonna be the bow, so... Screw it. Screw it, let's fight! Hey! Da -da 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 we got the same garbage. Battle mode. Mechanical constructs are guarding... Three portals in the area. Destroy all of them before more are summoned. Okay. Ready to serve, my lord. Oh, they are so close to each other. Wow. Moving into position. Let's run, boy. Oh my god, she runs! She actually all runs. Right. Oh, it's so cool. Out. All right, money Marte in here. Oh, they have fucking towers. I just realized. Is it some water tower? God damn it. At your service. Boom, boom on that. Yeah, go in, 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 go in. Crit. How may I help? Hundred percent crits. Yeah. 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 Oh. Money not done. Oh my god. Consider it The little robot thing is running too. Oh my god, we are so fast. Oh, plus six movement speed. That's why everybody's running everywhere. Because we are cool. Right between the eyes. Can we debuff this thing? Oh, it can be marked. Nice. Money. Oh, there's a fucking tower there. Kill it. It's a water tower too. Kill it. Kill yes, that water spirit. tower. It's dirty. It's gross. Hero Amin. Hero Amin. Yes. Oh, someone jumped at us. What the hell? They're jumping. Going. Jumping Jesus. Yes, sir. 
Go. What is this guy doing? Ready to serve, my lord. Whee! Your wish is my command. Yes. Everybody kill. Yeah, we did it. Victorious. Yes. Victorious. <gasps> Wait. Oh, that's a tower, not a portal. I mean, not that. Whatever. Victorious. Victorious. Look at this. Oh, he's out of mana. Look at that. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Pilot damage on. Yeah. Create a wall. Wall of society. Yeah. We got shitty pants. Ah, uh, damage. Oh, look, little boys here. It's got 1.6 DPS. Little boy. Doesn't have a name. We got some garbage pants. Mage pants. Yeah, they do nothing. Absolutely nothing. And she's got the the mage pants, the actual mage pants. Right. Ripperino. Oh, Faradus, we are back. We're back to you. How wonderful. So much gold all over the place. What is this thing? Dispensing machine. It says parts dispensary. The item we require may be located here. Completely abandoned, untouched, for perhaps hundreds of years. I doubt to find anything from this. It's autonomous and therefore should still contain a good selection of items. Should look for a way to power it. Stick Faradus in there. Oh, we did. Old typing device. Is this the triangle? Don't remember. The code. Oh, note with the code is right here. Two two six eight. Expedition breastplate. Two two six eight. Huh. Reinforcing obsidian plate of greater resistance. Woes. Woes. Garbage armor. Uh, better resistances, obviously. Some penny. Less health. More mana. Less regen. More speed. More health and mana increase. And we can enchant it. What can we put on this thing? <gasps> Ooh, ooh. Skill damage he doesn't need. Immunity thing is whatever. 8% for himself or 6% to everyone in 14 meter. That's nice. Yep, I mean, this would be not bad. 0.5 mana each second. Uh, yeah. Gets a lot less health. Still almost 700. His armor goes down to 85. It's definitely armor that we want to put on this. Two. That's still kind of pooters. Four armor less. Ugh. His resistance is changed. Oh yeah, because he loses earth resistance. 13%. That's okay, because the others get up by 12. That's pretty good. Gets penetration that he doesn't need. Less health, more mana. More movement speed. He actually moves, but he doesn't really need that either. Uh, I'm gonna give this to the dwarf. Also, the dwarf is more often close to the uh, to the weak line. The damage line. I send Kane away in, in further, further parts and during battles. So this is the obsidian plate of greater resistance, and this is the reinforcing obsidian plate of greater resistance. It's an upgrade. Look at that. 
so it it got that extra two armor from the forging but otherwise oh it has the health increase and money increase perfect it's basically that green one but forged twice or you know not forged but like forge forged not item forged and it can also have some uh, resistances Ah, perfect! Yes. Oh yeah, because he's got the positive leg, negative chest. She's got the positive chest. Oh yes, she does. And the positive leg, or feet, rather. He's got the positive feet as well. And now he's got positive chest. Nice! Everybody's got some uh, resistance aura. So our resistances are pretty dope. Pretty dope. What, is, what are these again? Oh, this would have been nice. Wait a minute. Take that off, bitch. So, 91 armor. 94 armor, 3.8. It's still kind of low. I want to keep him above 5. Or at, at 5, at least. Yeah. Eh, that's okay. By the time he can easily use this, he'll have something with more armor. So, I, I think I should just break this. Although he's got the corrupted gauntlets, he's got the. Uh... He had something else that was kind of corrupted, or maybe it was the obsidian shield. I don't know. I also got the corrupted stuff. Man, the corrupted set. Although there's no set bonus in this game, as far as I've I've seen. All right, let's talk to Faradis. But first, let's see what was that fucking triangle thing. Mac is active. Okay. History of numbers. Nani. Geometry shapes and codes. Oh, 0180, but it's for something else. So it's not for this. Can I just. Obviously, I have to try it. Man. Hey, Faradus, you still happy with your dingle bits? Whatever that is. Thank you, my friends. You have returned purpose to an old forgotten statue. Faradus is contemplating the fountain as its waters circulate endlessly. Our champions leave him to think. Aww. Adorable old machine, I guess. That thing looks cool. In the distance. Why do I keep pressing M for the map? It doesn't do anything. There's a dispensing machine. There's another portal. Faradus. Faradus' fountain. Huh? Small chest. Let's check what's over here. Oh, oh my god. This thing just never ends. This is the same level. Holy shit. Another fountain down there. Platform, emergency panel, lever, metal caps, geometric shapes. Oh, there we go. Vibrating gears, that's what I like to see. Strange cylinders? Ooh. That's the kink chamber. Alright. Got some boilers. Extremely bad crafted metal barrels. Gauges inside the slate pressure, but when Kane pushes on them for his, or hits them, they all don't fluctuate. They're all, all just broken ass boilers. Or at least the pressure gauges are broken. Oh no, poo gas. We can't go into the poo gas area because it's dirty. HOT! Organic beings cannot enter this place. The generator is a hybrid of magic and technology. Containing enough artidium to prove lethal. Artidium? It's gonna give us arthritis. Or oh, whatever. Arthritis. But we got a note and a scroll? Yeah. I know of this substance in our lore of great lord Vantesh brought the kingdom under an northern mountain known to contain this silver substance of high luster. In extracting vast quantities of the precious metal, Vatish. Is it Vantesh or Vatish? Get your shit straight, Rakim. Flourished at first. Or maybe the lord was called Vantesh and Vatish is a place, hmm? First. But as his engineers and miners went deeper, his people were vowed a mysterious affliction. 
One year after the sickness began, an ambassador from a neighboring kingdom visited and found the entire kingdom stinking of death. Cautiously making his way toward the king's stronghold, the ambassador found rotting corpses at every turn from the streets of the Grand Halls to the Grand Halls. Nearly every dwarf and skeleton lay robbed of its hair. The ambassador is, what the hell, who would rob the hair? The ambassador escaped back to his own kingdom, where the turn Balor what? lost his hair and died two days later. Vantish's kingdom, okay, so it's Vantish, has since been sealed off to all dwarves, and our tridium is known among my people as cursed silver. It's, it's Death Fog from uh, Divinity Original Sin 2. I need to know what that word is, Palor. Is it paler, but oldish? Yes, it is. Great. He turned pale. He died. He's got radiation sickness. Done. I mean, not really, because his skin didn't flake off and his DNA didn't break up and didn't melt under his own skin that was flaking off. Eh, radiation sickness is bad for you. Large stockpile of Arthridium, gross referenced and indexed. Thank you, Rockham. However, please note. <laughs> nice. I can come and go freely here. Arthridium has no effect on my systems. Uh, can you fix it then? I mean, please fix it for us if you can. An inspection of current systems that is required. Please stand by. Give us that scroll if you're at it. And those notes too. Look at him, so cute. Look at his little body. Bleep bloop, bleep bloop. Bleep bleep bloop. Oh. Get that gold while you're at it. Why don't you? Oh. Look at him, he's cute. He comes back. Oh. Well? No, that's not a well, that's a generator, you dumb fuck. Also, he's standing in the poo, poo splotches. He's probably not having fun. System damage report, only 33% operational. Nay, that didn't sound good at all. Do not worry, I can restore the generator. It only requires a few key components. The area here held in generating cores of the tower. There's a high likelihood of all the spare parts you need may be acquired easily. Coin kidding. What do you need specifically? Tell us what to look for and we'll recover them. There are four required components. I will have the generator up and running within minutes of integrating all four parts. The generator requires a monocoupler. Platinum rod, ignition pilot, and a mana diffuser. How do you get a pilot from, man? Everybody here is a skeleton. <laughs> Fine, fix and activate the power generator. How, how about I fucking don't care? I'm afraid I cannot descend below yet. You cannot. The area is filled with toxic gas. You need to repair the power generator first. It can ventilate. I don't care. Installation guide. Another code, money, and an enchant. Oh, that's an enchant scroll, not just a lesser scroll, it's an enchant. Error! Reactor power up interrupted, planar orbit is not installed. Mono diffuser, mono coupler, and a pilot. We need a pilot. Oh, look, it's a metal cylinder. How convenient. Large cylinder, hot to the touch, flickering yellow light that flutters and changes in intensity. Oh, it's shy. It's fluttering at us. Oh, don't look at me. I'm a yellow light. Oh, look! Oh, I thought it was leaves. Oh, I thought they chopped up a tree here or something, but no, it's probably just barf. Rust barf, that is. Alright, so we need some parts and shit. I don't think we've seen... I mean, there's a... Oh, that's the garbage scroll. Yeah, it's poopy. Uh, there's, there's nothing. I guess we go the one way we can go. Up the stairs. Maybe we can salvage these tree things, actually. But let's just keep going on. Because I've seen like two of these mechanical trees. Or whatever they are. Although they are not... They are not addressed on the map. They are not actually uh, shown. Yeah. Not shown on the map, so... It would be nothing. Alright, small chest. Touch time. Ooh, tier 2 plus pff, armor penetration 6. Uh, 
maybe mana points. She doesn't really need health and gem on region. Three might 44.3 DPS turns into 41.3, but she gets six more penetration for magic and armor. And it's got an enchant and a thing. These are kind of pointless. Although for one green. Point one mana regeneration, hell yeah. Because yeah, it goes from three. Oh, actually, that three is pretty good. Where is that? Oh wait, it's negative. Crystal ring of defa defa defecation, deflection. Oh wait, which one is the one she has? Oh, this is the new one. This gives. Oh, the old one was negative. Oh, it's showing this. Fuck you. Get off. Stupid shit. That's why I was confused. Like, what the hell? Mono regen. Oh, this gives one mono regen. And... Man. Well, someone else want penetration. You don't need penetration at all. You don't need much penetration. Although it gives magic pen. What is this? Two might. He doesn't need might. Although this one has decent regen as well. Health regen, it already has 5%, but it has 3 mastery. It says... what does this have? 6%. So 1% extra, but he loses a bunch of skill power. It is, as they say, trash. This is garbage too. It says mana per hit. Oh, it's been, yeah, sure. She's got that now. And he doesn't really need... Actually, what does he have? Mastery. Absor oh, this one is the distilled mana ring. Yeah, that's good for him. This one has just health and health regen. That's kind of shit, too. Yeah, you know what? Give that ring to him. What is this ring? Void resistance. Pfft. Minus 20% health. Ew. Yeah, so compared, gives him penetration, a lot less health, but some regen and movement speed is good for him because he does not have movements, movement uh, things. Yeah. I can put some ancient on it. It's garbage. That is garbage. He attacks every three seconds. He, he, and he's got 5.3 mana regen. That would be. Five point uh, what six I guess per second that's kinda shit. Oh with a code Ooh Mana Diffuser ninety eleven Oh that's that's almost uh that's almost one of those uh, numbers that Americans don't like Did we just go up on the fucking Ventilation pipe like it's nothing. Wow, look at that. That is... Is that the Titan? Looks like that's its head. Although it connects... Well, it goes higher. Giant... Shoulders? Or maybe this is... Maybe this is its crotch. It has a... It has a crotch laser. These are the thighs. And it goes a lot higher. Oh, this might be the Titan and we just see its dick right now. So 911 is the code with a zero in it for for good measure so it doesn't trigger anybody. Where is the dispensary? 911. Oh, that's the mana diffuser. That's the stuff we need. That's a quest item, not a Look at that crotch is looking at us. Ew. I thought it was some kind of cool item, like a wand or something, that I would have broken. But no, it's one of the required parts. How lame. Lesser scroll. Oh, wrong pipe. 44. 44? How ridiculous. If you know, you know. If you don't know, you don't need to know what that reference was. 
The strange lamp. Oh, what the fuck are these? What is dead? What is this thing? Looks like a little creature. But it's not. There's another one. It's dead. It's a lake or something. Oh no, what happened here? Strange lamp, mounted horizontally to the wall. It has been tampered with, but your champions have no clue what purpose it serves. Can the robot tell us? Robot? Come on. What the fuck? Someone completely wrecked the place. Yep. Oh, look, strange lamps. Maybe they can cut through if we activate them. Oh, a skeleton. Nice. Devastation of the area ahead. Slows your champion's approach to crawl. Ugh. Massive crater consumes the floor, and every wall sits lower, bowed outward at the middle. Wait, what? Massive crater consumes the floor? Where? There's a something. It's like a mushroom. Or not. Anyways, might be the pilot. One of these skeletons will become a pilot. Uh, as if a great force pushed the walls at the center all at once. The only explanation in a battle is a battle with the mysterious Dave. Have you seen destruction of such a scale? A truly powerful magic must have been at work here. I don't think it is magic. I don't sense any mana residues. I believe the source was conventional. It just blew up. Someone ate a lot of Mexican food and they just... See, everybody just tried to escape the fart zone. This guy was clearly the culprit. Just... Yeah. A single flame burns the brick to ash, but only the dragon's breath can melt metal such as this. Oh no. First it was 9011. Now we are talking about melting metal with fire. Can jet fuel melt the uh, steel beams? And yet I see no dragons here. Oh no, it's a reference to 911. That's kind of bad. That's fucked up. If the source of this destruction was indeed terrorism, I mean technology, Jesus Christ. If the ancients had access to such power, then tell us, Rune Lord, how come it did not save them from the enemy of old? Huh? Why are you asking me? Clearly the enemy wielded even stronger power. Mech, do you know anything of this? No. Stand by. It's gonna do a little beep boop run. Beep boop, beep boop. Oh, look. Oh, it's looking. Oh my god, this place is so huge. It's eating the corpses. Oh, and I just trampled that guy. That's a victim of terrorism, man. You can't just walk through them. And we're just looking. I estimate the energy output of the explosion which destroyed this chamber at 100 megajoules minimum. Faint traces of our tritium indicate that the explosives used were not conventional. Do not worry, however, the particle count is minimal and is not harmful to organic beings. Did anyone understand the word he just said? I mean, I think yes. I understood. Please allow me to explain again. Never mind, I'll wait until another time. Thank you, Mac. Basically, somebody terrorized this place to death. And it's safe now. It's a 9-11 reference. Definitely. No doubt about it. There's some glimmering there. But a dozen human skeletons lie strewn about the area. Remnants of great and ancient battle. Lit candles and melted remains of many long expired surrounding the skeletons. Skeletons have been set with much care. Someone honors the dead. Yet not enough to bury them. I mean, just kind of shove them off the side. Let them fall into the abyss. Perhaps it was not within the power to remove them from this place. I already not have any place suitable to put them to rest. Must tread carefully and honor the sanctity of this chamber. Dead need no wealth. Exactly. The dead do not want. They should search them for valuables. Appalled. Have you not an ounce of decency? They are not my people, but I will have no part in their desecration. I will. Are you gonna eat that? This this elf is shameful. Or, you know, it brings shame to the other elves of other games. Of corpse eating caliber. Maev shrugs and moves toward the nearest skeleton, impassioned. Eric turns to Kane with wide eyes before Maev can reach the remains. Boron steps before her, blocking the way. Oh no, it's it's a thing where I'm going to tell them to fucking loot the corpses because fuck you. 
A few words have been spoken. You can feel the tension between your champions. They're about to have a, the nastiest orgy with skeletons. Maybe wise to focus your will to influence the force of action. I don't know when I last saved, but most of it was... Oh, we are... Hello? Oh, there we go. Will you impeach your will to let the party... Let them decide first. Oh no, they don't let them loot. So we get health and elemental resistances. We lose skill power and attack speed. That won't stand with me. But let's see how this plays out. It's very slow now. Whether or not your actions decide, blah, 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 you allow them to choose themselves, they come to peace. And uh, you're still stuck. Green to leave the skeletons be, your champions give a quick visual survey of the chamber and move to leave. As Eric and Boron stay behind for a final bow to honor the dead, bow. Faint blue light rises from each skeleton. The spiritual energy hovers in place for a moment and shoots into your own two champions. I mean, Boron, we don't care about. Eric getting a buff is okay. An experience they describe as invigorating and uplifting. Can we move yet? We can. Okay, invigorating and uplifting, but not useful. Whatsoever. Ah, that's okay. We, we had no... Ah, oh, we were right here. It doesn't matter. Blah, 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 blah. He goes and takes a little survey. Looks at the skeleton, looks at the tiles, touches the floor. Too bad we can't skip this. Oh, what is that down there? Is that a scroll? We have one blueprint on this floor. So, you know, there's that to watch out for. Right, let's save. Save, 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 good. Touch the skeleton. Skeletons dodged. Pay respect, fuck them. Search them. Yeah! Potential gain in finding an item or document to avoid your champions accomplishing their task, to aid your champions, far outweighs the religious practices of the long deceased. Focus your will on your champions and suggest they aid my aim in searching the skeletons. Uh, they produce little at first. After the Queen of Shadows aids Maeve in her effort, the two locate a lot of gold! Nice! It may not be a hidden key or a scroll of ancient wisdom, but your champions will certainly put this wealth to good use. Nice! That is basically the upgrade cost I put into Boron. Uh, it's just like three or four hundred or something. So, you know. Yeah, it was four hundred. Look at that. that. That is actually pretty good. Oh my god, I could upgrade Kane. <laughs> <clears throat> While we are up here, let's do one of the fights. Let's do an elite group for this wand. Yeah. And money. And just because I haven't killed anything in a while. Oh look, we keep the robot in the challenges. This might be the best time to do the challenges. We have an extra pair of boots on the floor. Your wish is my command. Your wish is, oh my god, look at these fucking things. Yep! Yeah! Alright, he goes in there. Orders. He goes in there. Advancing! Heruamin. Heruamin. Whatever that means, but yes. whatever it means is probably cool, right? Can you attack? Oh wow, they just Go died. Money Marte. Oh shit, Money Marte. Monka. My lord? Out. You're gonna just For honor and glory. Shit. Money Marte. My Shoot please, daddy. quick. Oh, it's fucking dead. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> she just killed it. Money. Forgot she's on Money auto critting now. Money Marte. Or not even auto critting, but like constant critting. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Yes. Money Marte. Get wet. There you go. <laughs> okay, so he's blocking that and almost one hitting things. He's blocking this and it's cool. Money Marte. Right between the eyes. She can move on a little here so she can actually right. shoot at these things. 
And he's gonna come closer to this. Uma de la. We can shoot at that. Lien. Unleash hell. That. Right between the eyes. And we're done. Giant fucking Sauron looking ass guy with a blue carpet on his back. He's dead now. And we got the cool, cool staff. Cool, cool wand, actually. Very cool wand. Oh my god, it's amazing. It's gone. It is gone. It's a trap. Let's do all these skeleton things. Why not? Let's finish yes, it my off. Lord. Who's... Yes. Oh, it's just Eric. It's fine. <laughs> We're fine. We don't care. Money not that. Let the rain May the light guide fall in Africa or something. Oh Bless the rain down in Africa. Literally, rains. Do. It's not anything weird. It's just rains. Moving out. I never miss. Yes, sir. Oh, that guy just got Get one hit. Yeah, go in there. Have fun. Oh, I got get one shot as well. Oh wait, we can speed this up. I keep forgetting we can speed shit up. I don't need to do anything. Let's keep summoning stuff. Put her on crits. Put that down there. Put that over here. Splash Mountain. Damn, I love that thing. Water Spirit. Although these are easy challenges, but I mean... Small swarm, sure. Easy, you know what? At your service. Your Move over there and just command. everybody just just on my way. Defend yourselves. Money, money. Watch out, giant man coming in. I am a lord. Unleash hell. Shalala. Heru Amin. Paint a wall! Money. Alright, that's done. Ah, it's the orcs. What do the orcs give? Oh, they give this armor shatter to just 20%. I mean, that's decent. What is this thing? Great Axe of Corruption! Ooh, it's another corruption stuff. Earth! Earth with 55 cleave. Spill power. I mean, it might replace that uh, blue earth axe. So, when might as well do it. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Where do the first ones come from? There. Okay, so. I'm gonna go out here. We'll do. Go. Oh. Just gonna push him out there so that's where he lives now. This guy's gonna walk over Onwards here. Onwards to the fray. Heru Amin. Yes. Yes. Mani Marte. No. Where's the dwarf? Yes, my lord. Oh, he's here. Did the thing. Oh, look at that. Just keep coming. Hey, just keep coming. On my way. Look at this guy, he's like, oh no, I'm dying. I never miss. I'm gonna send my I'm aim my up way. there. A little of course. Help. Oh he's done. Didn't even need to speed it up. There wasn't a lot of enemies in there. So let's see. What does do? If you put on this thing, let's see. So it's less less damage. It's also slower. Actually, it's more damage, but it's slower, I see. No air. Uh, more cleave. Five penetration, that's okay. Um, 16% skill increase instead of 18, but it has the whirlwind on it, and this one would need to be forged for it. And I don't really want to forge this. Like, forge forge to tier upgrade it. I also don't want to item forge it, because it's kind of pooters. So... We have that. We don't need that. 
And we it puts this back. So against Earth things, that's gonna be nice. Might as well get that upgrade, alright? These are just monies. Money monies. Find that challenge from the orcs. Defeat the grey shamans and their guards. Cool. Let's do How that. How may I help you? Alright. It's nice that you know of these course. challenges can be done in any order at any time. No probs. So after a long time of just oh, I can't speak for a second. Reading yes, lore. On my way. After a long time of reading lore, I can just do whatever. Kill things. Yes. Daddy needs to kill things. Let's go. There's a dude with a crop. Touch bow. My lord. Sire, moving out. Do I mean? Something coming from behind. Orders. Heading out. New boss stage, and it's almost dead. Oh no, it's it lives. Money. Quick, we got a rain on Africa. I never miss. Something. I did hope that's not offensive to say, so because <laughs> I don't know. It's a song or some shit. Slow, immobilized, murdered. I think that's the last guy. Oh no, there are more. Oh my god, he's dead. It's probably dead. Let's speed it up. We don't. Enchant that we don't use. Alright. I'm not gonna do the tiny ones. Let's go back into the tower. Machine works! Oh, I never read this. So there's a vast complex filled with ancient machinery. The, the purpose behind most of the machines remains undiscovered. In the middle of the level, a giant power generator occupies the space, supplying a mythical electricity to all deeper floors. Oh, electricity. They just don't know what it is, so it's electricity. Oh, I just got that. Wow. I'm slow. Despite eerie metal floors and walls, this area feels strangely comforting. Yeah, because it's, it's pretty. Alright, gotta live with my cat first. of life here is high indeed. Upon closer inspection, doesn't seem to be any consistency in cause of death among skeletal remains. They all died in different ways. Glimmering. Oh. Or maybe glimmer ring. <laughs> Look, something glimmering in the corner. Moves to investigate. It's a signet ring. I wonder why it wasn't destroyed in the explosion. I guess someone could have dropped it here after the fact. Let me take a look, Glassy. Ah. What is it, Yard Dwarf? What do your keen eyes? And Dwarven I spy. Oh my god, it's Lord of the Rings now. What is it, Legolas? What do your Elven eyes see? Ah, I see the crows coming. They have to hide! Me! And also, it's a red sunset or whatever. People died. Ah, nothing too significant. Just They're just taking the hobbits to Isengard. I was just admiring the craftsmanship. It is exquisite. If it did survive the destruction of this room, its resilience would make it quite significant. I suggest we hold on to it. Study later. Wasn't there some kind of mention of a signet ring? In some text at some point? Pocketing the ring. Ah, oh, yeah, boy, I'm keeping it. A rose is a rose by any other name. Did we not read of a signet ring before? One that is... Ah! Okay, I'm not imagining things. There was one. A hidden retreat. Oh, yes. 
He didn't retreat. We got the ring. There's a big guy over there. We're gonna kill it. Gold and enchant. A Fermic Chain Stew applies 50% slow for 10 seconds and has 8% chance to daze for 3 seconds. Alright, for ranged weapons. No. I will never use that. Why have CC when you can kill things in one shot? Oh, this is Blight Down, but it's filled with poo gas. And the guy is like, Mech! Like, it's not gonna let us go. There is definitely some kind of giant bean. And do something about the toxic gas. Once the reactor is operational, we can go down there. Alright, so no blight down for us. Maybe that's the generator and it's gonna start spinning. Although, if it starts spinning, that place is fucked. And they have a code and such. So once again, we have one way to go. And that's where Whisper is going on her own record. Oh shit! Big, big guy. Is that the air lancer? What is that thing? Oh yeah, that's probably the air lancer. Deal with the waves of enemies that increase in strength one by one. Eh? Yes. Oh, it's this place again. So we're just gonna move here and just wait for what everybody. She's gonna get jumped. Yes. That's okay by me. All right. A little more. Ah! Oh shit, he's getting fucked. That's okay. Be fine. Look at that. Monka. Onwards to the fray. At once, sire. I'm just gonna sit here. My blade he's gonna sit to in there. Right between I'm gonna the sit eyes. here. Create. And I'm just gonna speed it up. Heroamin. Sora. Actually, you can you can sit in here. Yes, moving. Yes. Mani Marte. I'm too lazy to just send my slow ass soldiers everywhere. I just I just summon half across the map. Look at that. Look at all that splash mountaining going on. And if anything comes out of these portals, my melee guys have it. Hello, tiny robot is getting hurt. I need a no. Oh look, something came across. And it promptly died. Oops, that's not what I wanted. That's okay. That's the totem. I don't even know what it looks like anymore. Barely use it. Yay, damage! 60 he did 65 damage! Oh, he does not have any armor penetration. Would be funny if we had to kill it at the end. Why does Connie have a skill point? Oh, what did we get? A crossbow. A green crossbow of air and fire. Incineration, but it barely deals fire. Air and fire. I mean, that's cool if we have something that really doesn't like air, but I mean, the crit chance is shit on it, so we don't care. She is physical and physical alone. It's good enough for her. She's focusing on that. By my will alone. Holy shit, that might be the Titan! Whoa, it's got a tiny head. That's something out of Bayonetta or something. Now we have Bayonetta here as well. Everything just accumulates in this game. This game has video games, movies, uh, happenings in real life, probably books as well. Music, definitely. Of course, a massive level, massive construct. I pray to great spirits who don't have to fight that thing. We definitely do because I've seen a picture. Ha! <laughs> Although that was like a, a post poster or something, like a cover art, where this thing was shown. It was probably this thing because I remember this giant fucking head thing. How strange. Although it could have been Whisper. 
A strange it seems to be adorned with a human-like head. To what purpose does an artificial being need an organic-inspired face? Most disturbing. Sure. It's an angel. There's the monocoupler. We got the big boilers. Bim bum bim bum. Things don't work. Chief engineer's note. Roman me, that madman, asked me to destroy the last of the lucidity crystals. He knows full well the generator could never be started again without them. Of course, it didn't do it. I told him I would defuse and annihilate them, but instead put them in one of the mech guardians and hid the construct in the engineer's retreat. That's where we need to go with the signet ring. Is it that guardian? Is it the giant fucking construct down there? Also, there's a portal. That might be the end. Only a few of us know how to get there, and I trust the other lads not to talk. Since I've lost, now lost all faith in Roman B's objectivity, I've taken precautions. Jamie did a fine job of turning that lamp near the generator entrance into a teleport crystal. Roman B will never find it. Even if he does, he'll find a nasty surprise waiting for him. The lamp near the generator entrance? It's the weird, strange lamp. It may be worth to go back there and take a look. So I'm forgetting the nasty surprise bit. Ah, it's just more money. We like to fight. As I struggle to fucking drink water. That's where we've come to. As the body falls apart, so does the mind. But the chest remains untouched. Whoa. Ew, tier 2, blue helmet. What the hell? And it's for her or him. Absolutely wild. Get out of here. Reload that. Give me something cool. It's a tier 2 staff. Okay, it's 96 money. How much money can we get from this? Because honestly, whatever else it gives is garbage. 94. It's a pistol! Pistol of Lightning. Physical with some air. It's chaotic, so it has that garbage on it. How is it so slow? <sighs> Should I actually break these three things as well at this point? Eh, well, I don't care. Alright. Saving gives way to lag. And that was a dead end, but we can teleport back to Farthest Mountain. But where is the... Oh, this is the thingy, so we should teleport. Saves us some time. Is that a giant wall down there? A strange lamp. Are these the strange lamps? These things? Is it gonna put this together? We need one more thing, I think. Beep boop. Oh my god, it's got an eye. Wow. It's coupling the mana. Wait, didn't we get three stuff? What the hell, man? Do items still need to be installed? But... Oh no, we only got the coupler and the diffuser. Yeah. Whoa! I don't see any lamp here, but we did have the strange lamps. Backways. Oh! Oh no, that's a metal cylinder. Although that's not really at the ele at the generator. Unless when they said behind it, they meant way behind it, because it's here. Strange lamp. Been a nasty bit of surprise. I almost have 6,000 money. I, I kind of feel like I should just upgrade everybody that I use. Oh, now it works. What? Okay. Bows! Now approaching the chief engineer's lab, the CE was responsible for many upgrades. And improvements. There is a light highlight here of finding something to fuse here. Okay, including a fight with robots. Aha! Big robots. Is. Engineers workshop. Lots of metal trees. As of twisted iron, twisted metal. 
and precariously balanced large gears, the sculpture emits an overwhelming smell of oil. It's unclear whether your party looks upon a work of art or some sort of collapsed machine. That's art. Duh. These guys got sentience and now they're building trees. It's literally fucking worship the monolith. He's got no head. That guy looks like a viking. Or a draugr. Platinum Road resides in the machine, guarded by this group of creatures. How do we see that from here? Did they, will they step, not step aside if we ask? Oh, the mech knows this is here. If only all creatures of this tower were so agreeable to our needs. Don't worry, we'll kill them. Kill every single one of them. After, we look around a little bit. Lot of trees, lot of trees, 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 trees. Is it a forge? Oh, yes. Ancient marvel. Metal tubes able to harness invisible energies and power ancient machines. All without a single drop of mana. An electric generator. Small forge, you say? Plus two damage and an enchant slot. Twenty percent more damage. Now uh, it's literally twenty percent cooler. Fifty-one. And it's got a weak knockback. And enemies stagger a bit when hit. That's the weak knockback. So it's got a little stagger. Got a little more damage. Can we use this twice. No. That sucks. Oh, what's that? Oh, there's the pilot. And we got uh, Dragnipur. It's a sword, one-handed. It purrs, it says physical. So let's swap to our physical arm. So less physical, faster, a lot faster. Doesn't have the stun, has more penetration, no health. Minus 20 health per hit and minus 20 mana per hit. What, on, on the Wielder or the enemy? I feel like it's the Wielder, right? Why the fuck would I want to use this? It's gone! Skeleton. Skeleton remains are fractured in multiple areas. What type of ancient could account for such wounds? I don't know. There's a code as well. This poor fellow died while studying. Too much knowledge can be a dangerous thing. Oh no! Finger but hole. 1008. Alright. 10 Oh, right back to Wolf. <laughs> Ignition pilot. Ignition pilot located, but he's dead. All the items we need fixing this power generator, right? Are you sure you're able to repair it? Affirmative. My memory retains complete schematics of the generator. It will be, as you call it, a piece of cake. We don't call it a piece of cake, it's a generator, but okay. Experimental airplate. More gold. Airplate. No armor. Just air so it's basically the gargoyle skin. It's yeah, it's pretty much it. More movement speed. Ooh. 4.8. Okay, that's tolerable. But the armor is a lot less. 98. Uh, actually 91. 91. <gasps> Look at that! Okay, so what, what, what are the changes here? So this is what we have right now. So... Earth resistance would go down, air resistance would go up, but air resistance is already pretty much... ...boinked. Yeah. So that's not really beneficial for us. Less health, more mana. Same regen and some movement speed. What would you get with the boots? Resistance, some health that we lose there, we get minus health regen. Okay, this is pointless. This is at this point pointless. Yeah. Same armor, less movement speed, less health regen. Different set of resistances. Yeah. Um, also kind of garbage here. Yo. And he can't wear it. Experimental. Exp 
Experimental Patronus. Yes. Take it. Drop the shoes. Movement speed for someone who doesn't have movement speed. Yes. Although he can throw fireball and make runes appear, but. Ah, maybe, maybe, sure. Maybe. 57 armor. But less. A lot less percentage. I'm just gonna break this. I had enough of not being able to decide what to do with it, so I just broke it. Another code, 8832, a helmet. Mm -hmm. That was it up here. Two codes, some garbage. Mm -hmm. Let's do the fight. Fight of the century. Yes, same thing. Unusually strong group of mechanical enemies are guarding an item. Yes, they look unusually strong. So strong. At your service. So strong, in fact, we are pissing ourselves. Hey, they can only come. Oh, that's so pretty. Look at that. That's nice. There's little worship pads for everybody. They sit around it, and it's like the Cult of the Lamb. Now we have Cult of the Lamb as well. They sit around the thing and worship. One, two, three portals. Well, you know what I'm gonna do. Moving into position. Sit in here. Arranged people Going. go a little hey, bad. I mean. Yes, my lord. Shut up. Right. I never miss. My knee. Right. Right on. Hi, my lord. Hey. Dunk. He's dazed. He doesn't know what to do. Blank. Doesn't really care about fire, does he? Or maybe he just got a lot of health. Yeah. Let's speed this up. Let's make a wall. Brr. The poor guy. Wow, we don't need to. Oh my god, she just right murders them. A little closer. Actually, I can drain all the way up here. Sora. Really? Asshole. Oh, days that can break their concentration. Look how slow these boys are. Get fucked. Yes. On my way. Amin Vera Yasende. I, my lord. Armor up. Guide your path. Money Marte. Look at that. Boom. Resistances. Okay, so. Holy crap. Look at that. 80, 80, 80, 80 on everything for him. 80 on everything for him. 75. 80, 72s, and 80. Who cares about the minus 30%? Hey, You know, if it's just stick together... No problem. <laughs> and he single-handedly just... Kills everything. Put another one down there. Put some healing on it, because it's dying. There we go. Another guy down there. Yeah, beat it. Yeah, easy. Easy. Look at the damage. Oh. <laughs> Kane did nothing. He received 30 damage, mitigated 70. So that was like 100 damage is what he received, I guess. But 70% was gone, so he only got 30 and healed it back. He just didn't care. He got more garbage pants. Garbage mage pants, yes. Uh, defense, okay. Health, health. Less movement speed and nothing else. Yeah, yeah alright. Let's get the rod. Platinum rod. Hmm. We got everything now. So we can make the thing happen. There's an ancient letter. Letter written on vellum lies staked to the table by a small knife. That's not a table. Gem! 
promised myself I would never reply to another of your insufferable notes again, yet here I am. We've been stuck together in this place for 30 years today, and you're still gibbering about the devil. They are not coming. Why not just kick back and enjoy yourself? We have all the money we need, eat, drink, and may marry. Your precious efforts to save the world have failed. Now these halls and walls will be the only world we will ever know. I never asked you expected any of this when I became a mage, or we can only play the hand we dealt. We may as well make the best of it. And don't call me Captain Brompton anymore, since early calling. Alright, so it is calling. Oh, that gold is not here. I've been lied to. Like how these things just basically float here. Because we could look down into that. How, what what kind of tower is this? It's all over the fucking place. It's like its own little pocket dimension where everything is weird. An ancient chest. Ooh, look at that. You can see down here. Or maybe this is a window. And these are actually walls, but... Eh. Look at the size of this place. It's incredible. How can all this be inside a... Thank you! A tower. <laughs> Do not forget the most powerful ma magi of our tower crafted this place. It does not necessarily have to obey common laws of the known world. Fuck you, I just talked about this. And then they mentioned it. Now I feel... Now I feel silly. I could have just kept my mouth shut and they would have explained it anyways. Yeah. Oh god, what is that? Bolt spitter of devastation. It's a one-handed little flower pistol. Bolt shitter. <laughs> oh! Ooh! Minus health, skill power, and nah. That's for my right? Yeah, it's garbage. That's garbage. That off the saint is kind of shit. It's a gun and less than a hundred mana or m money. What the hell? It's a that's a staff. Tier three green staff, vampiric mystic staff. But the vampiric is kind of pointless. It's air. Twenty six fire. Oh, that's the resistances. That's pretty cool. Twenty four penetration. No crit, no skill power increase. Looks cool. But he's got a bitch. Oh, money. Nice. Now we can put together the end, the generator and we can also get two items from the dispenser. 1008 and uh, the other one I don't remember. Okay. We can look it up. It's in our thing. Where's the generator? Where are we? So that was that place. Vantage point. Oh yeah, we did that. Yeah. Like how we couldn't use the lamp until we read about the lamp needed for the retreat. Or maybe it was because we didn't have the signet ring. We picked it up here. Actually, we picked it up here. So, yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Fuck it. it didn't work. I want the magic stuff first. I want to dispense. The generator can wait. Apologies, this item is out of stock. You son of a bitch. Whoops. Try harder dispensing device. I need it. Can we request the same thing twice? It just doesn't do anything. Okay. Memory, mystery of numbers. Expedition Breastplate, Mono Diffuser Regard, Armageddon's Blade would have been the 1008, wow. And the helmet is 8832. Whoa! Give me another one. <sighs> Alright, Constructs Obsidian Great Helm of Devastation! Decent armor, it's better. 
It's purple, so it has a slot. It is the constructs, so movement speed can go bye-bye again. Fuck! Health less, resistance is less, but he doesn't care about that. He's already cool. Less health and mana, that's fine. Crit chance! Whoa, devastation! What does this asshole have? Uh, garbage is what he has. Spell power, health, same. He loses some crit chance, but... But I don't care. Right, we can forge this. We can forge um, more critical chance on it, but we're gonna do with armor. Because that's what he needs. What does he have? Oh, he still has the tier 2 stuff because he's only level 5. Poor man. Because this guy already has level... Oh, it's tier 2 plus at level 10. Ah, sucky. Sucky wucky. Alright, 16 armor, that's pretty good. Ah, uh, and Seed could have been the thing to put on it. But it, it's not even something to do. An enchanted head armor. Penetration he does not need, so I'm gonna wait for whatever this is. Although they can be swapped around the enchants, I think so, yeah. Still, it's a waste of purple. We don't need that, he doesn't need penetration. Thorns and the retribution do not care about penetration or armor or anything, so that's fine. And it's currently dealing fire damage. So, yeah, I mean, once he goes back to physical, sure that that penetration. Although that's very minuscule amount, because it's twenty percent of four. It's nothing. Although the magic penetration could be nice actually, for the fire. Ah, put it in. Okay. So he's cooler, you know. Wow, 28%. Wow, plus one. Yay. Generator, let's go. And then the rest of the map opens up. Go, little robot, go! Look at his little legs. Stick legs. And he already touched that one. Rubbish. That doesn't even do anything. I guess it's just a rod. Oh no, he's doing something. <gasps> Sparks! That's beautiful. The amount of life, and it poofs gas now. And that one is the pilot. Or maybe not. Wow. Oh! It's kind of jumped. Yeah, it works. All missing parts are installed. You can now turn on the generator. All items are installed. The procedure of generator power up is initiated now. Stand clear. <laughs> and it just removes the thing. Oh, that is the generator. And it does spin, but not like this. But just like the little things on it. Nice. Radioactive material removed. You don't need a robot anymore. Our generator system is now operational and can be activated, supplying required power to the ventilation system. Nice. Thank you for your help, Mac. Gratitude is not required. Repairing tower systems is my function. You have a single drop in the oh, shut the fuck up. You have allowed me to perform my primary function. The gratitude should be mine. Don't forget to turn on the generator before you proceed. Yeah, we did that. Is he not coming with us now? Or? Oh, no, he's still coming. That's nice. Installation guide. Thick book generator XQ99 installation user manual. Champions leave through this, but they don't give a fuck. Because the robot already did it. We don't need to know. Someone else knows. Enchant- <gasps> Time to upgrade our legs. Ethereal absorption. Two. Blah, blah. Wow. Ah, you got thorns, you don't care.
that his leg cannot have things? What does he have in his leg? Oh, it's, it's this, yeah. Well, I guess he upgraded to 8.4, which is awesome. I guess. What does he have on this? Why, why don't we use the blind helmet? Uh, skill power. Oh, the penetration. Look at that. Armor and magic penetration. Oh, because it has the uh, spectral sight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright. You got a chest. What the fuck is that? A shield? Oh, it's a shield. It's pretty shitty. Oh my god, constructs. The game literally is having a laugh at me. Or at me. Less armor, it's not purple, so it can't have the reflect. Although that reflect is not that important. The thorns are better. So if we can get more shield on the or armor on this, and we can. Oh, but it's fucking movement speed, dude. Nine extra armor, so it could be twenty-five. I, I hate that loading or oh, not loading screen. A movement speed debuff. Fucking constructs. Ooh, crit chance cause! Yay! Better armor, better health, same attack speed and cooldown, and same crit. So it's just an upgrade. 10 extra health and 3 extra armor. And it doesn't even have the forge upgrades, so it can have even more crits. Crits. Because if I can get to the point where she has 100% crit without the uh, fire arrows, I can swap the fire arrows out for something else, like the phantom bow, for example. Because I only need the fire arrows for the crits, I don't care about the fire enchant on it, it's kind of garbage. Extra 10 damage plus fire per shot, wow. It's kind of shit at this point, but the crit chance is very nice. 87, ooh baby. Boron, can you want to... do you need this? No? Cool. Nice! Note with code! Tower Avatar! Oh look! We can summon ourselves an own Avatar! 80-84! That's nice, we don't need that. Oh, that's the secret of Tower Avatar! Okay. Installation place for ignition rod, platinum rod... I mean, pilot, not monocoupler and the diffuser. Well, now we know. Alright, let's see what the secret of the Mana Crystals is about. That's another video game. Or is it just secret of Mana? I don't know. Doesn't matter. 8080 something. What? Was that the one though? Yeah, 8084, Secret of Tower of a Tower. And it's out. No Armageddon Blade, no Tower of a Tower Secrets. We can't read its diary. So now we go down to Blight Town. Yes. Nothing else. Oh, yeah, that's garbage. That's a negative fountain. Yeah. <sighs> Look, the thing is now swimming in green juices. Look at that. It condensed the uh, gases into liquid. I guess. I guess, huh? Oh, what is this thing moving? Oh, it's like the. It's part of the generator, I guess. Oh, yeah, it's the. the torso area. Oh, here we go, let's do a big shave. Me. Down this very peculiar bridge. What the, wh why? Why is this like this? It's so nasty looking. Oh, money! How many blast the steps? Where is one of those fancy teleporters when you need it? Down there, somewhere. Seem to go on without end. Maybe they'll lead us straight to the bottom of my lord's goal. Seeing how this level is far larger than anything we've encountered so far. It's unlikely the stairs lead to anywhere beyond these borders. If 
Is anyone who's not listening, the lower we go, the larger the construct becomes. That construct. Oh, the, the one we are going to have to fight soon. We're going to blast it into pieces. Wherever it is, we kill it. Oh, that is trippy. Oh, rods in darkness. Yes. That's a horror mystery novel right there. Rods in darkness. Hasn't been written yet, but I assure you the title will exist at some point. We got the teleporter. We don't need to climb the blasted steps anymore. And we got a fountain that looks pretty cool. Is it air resistance? Drink it. Armor increased by four. Perfect. That stays the way it is. Honestly, I should just make Kane drink everything. Because most of the fountains he gets anyways. Enchant scroll. Oh, it's in there. Cutscene! Despairing, the Urgante decided then to end their existence, not willing to harm other sentient races who watched with growing horror at the devastation of their galaxy. So they stopped looking for new energy sources, gathered themselves all in one place, and waited for the end. They lingered in dark space for a long time, but the end did not come. Their life force, made of thought, could not die, and they grew even hungrier. Maddened by their desire to feed, they descended on the rest of the galaxy, absorbing all that stood in their path, all sentient races, their ships, their planets, their suns. Sun. No longer caring about killing billions of intelligent life forms, they cared only about the energy they contained. Soon nothing was left, an empty space, devoid of even a single electron of energy. Just the Organte. The change in the nature of the Organte allowed them a different understanding of the laws of physics. They discovered connection points between galaxies, places where space and time bend and connect. They searched feverishly for a new feeding ground, and discovered a point in space connecting their universe to ours, located right above our planet. It was just a window which they couldn't open, yet. For the laws of physics in our universe were different from the ones of the Organte. They needed a stable bridge to cross over. So, they devised a plan. They needed to release some of their energy into our world to mix it together and build a stable connection in between. Billions of the Organte sacrificed their last remaining life force, turning it into a state of consciousness to create nodes of power, which then were pushed through the window and placed on our planet. The nodes of energy, which we called magic, people absorbed it, mixed it with their own life force, and then released it into the world creating new energy in the process. This new energy was now compatible with the Organtes and could be used by them. The perfect trap. Taunt the people with power so immense that they did not question the price they paid for it. So now, the Organte simply waited with anticipation until enough energy would be present to allow them to create the connection bridge waiting to be able to descend on our galaxy and consume it. Also, it didn't say create a bridge, it was form a bridge. Anyways. Oh, yo, yo, I'm a chair. The chair is squeaky. Are they gonna talk about it or? No, we just, we just move bottom of the stairs. All right, just, the organ day did what we thought they would do. Or what we thought we did, they did. It was pretty obvious. I've seen Maguka. Maguka. And I also have common sense. Most of the time. 
Strange machinery. No, 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 don't go there. It's it's poo gas. It's it's juice. We're gonna dip into the juice. We don't wanna dip into the juice, do we? Do we re paradox? That's just one guy with big legs. It's an auto cutter. Enraged auto cutters swarm your party. Your frontline warriors can handle them in tarots, but your fragile champions will get shredded within seconds. A lot of little boys cutting us to sheds. Sire? So where do they come from? Where is the where is the janky point? You could just stand here and just not care. You could just stand here and not care. So we got one guy in this row. We got Sire, at once, sire. Actually, this is this is a pretty nice choke. Moving out. Right here. At your service. Yes. Goes in here. At your service. Puts that on the skin. Unleash hell. Puts the lotion on the skin. Or else gets the hose again. Uma de la. I never miss. Yes, my lord. Let's speed it up. Yeah, look at it go. Okay, fucking what's his face just doesn't care. Bing bong. Yes, my lord. Heal everybody. Use your powers of. Nah, just stay there. Yes. Sire. Boom boom. Can also use oh, the hammers of taunting. So that was it. A lot of very weak things. Very nice. Got another pistolera. Pistolera. Oh my god. Twenty four percent crit chance. I mean, if we get another one of this, obsidian pistol devastation. Although double enchanted uh, one-handed crit pistols could be better. Oh, it gained another thingy mingy. Oh. Ninety-one percent crit chance without the skill. I, I think I don't need this anymore. Or actually, just yeah, put these away. Put put this as well. So this is all she needs on it. Honestly. He doesn't need anything else on it. 12% is now more than enough to put her over 100. So we can upgrade this. Wow! She needs to level up more. She needs to level up to 8. <laughs> Whatever. Metal caps! Series of small metal caps open and close in perfect synchronicity. At regular intervals, all the caps open at once and release a hiss of steam. Okay, there's a bunch of levers. It might be a puzzle. You got moving gears. Gears move so slowly and so smoothly you hardly notice they move at all. Pretty much sure about this being just a edge bait. This don't move. Also, it's not even centered. That that fucking rod. It's not a center rod. Emergency platform reset. Emergency panel. Okay. Emergency platform reset code is zeros. Oh my goodness. What happened? Nothing happened. Oh, it's the reset. This whole area is gonna be a puzzle. That I do not like, because it looks like it's a lot of move, move around like an idiot puzzle you know it's not a difficult one but just you do you want to collect all the treasure you gotta do the thing like four times kind of kind of deal note with code do not enter this code zero one twelve well do you know what the barbara strays in the fact is uh, you don't want it uh, it, 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 it or maybe the strays and thing is it's trying to say that it doesn't exist so people look it up. I don't know, it might not be the same thing, but... 
Anyways, do not press the button. We press the button, basically. It's, it's, I don't care. So the uh, diffuser is so far away from the portal. It's pissing me off. Why can't we move? There we go. Yeah, we're running somewhere. Do not enter 01112 because you will die. Yay, money! Mechanical constructs are guarding three portals. Destroy all of them before more are summoned. Easy. Yes, my lord. It's always money three not portals. Oh, look, a different arena. That looks, that looks very 40k mechanicus. Except these fucking trees here. The green light, the very square everything. Or green, green jism on the floor. Nice. Okay, select everybody. Yes. Let's go at that. This guy goes at the tower. Moving hey, into me. position. Oh, she's getting fucked. Yes, sire. Yes, sire. Hey! Yeah, daze them. Daze them. Screw with them. Screw with their heads. Yes. At your service. I'm a lord. Damn, we just yes. murdered them. Your wish is my command. Look, they're walking. Money Marte. Alright, Money Marte, guys. It's time to summon she. Is that a water tower? Oh, it's Earth Tower. Okay, so we can water it down. Yes. We did it! Yay! Affirmative! Look, a bunch of weak shit. Oh my god, they just flew. Yes, moving. Point point. Moving out. Right between the. Why is this guy dying? On my way. Maybe he was being Money attacked by the. Uh... Stop. Bing bong bong. Ooh, hoods. Is that hoods for magic or hoods for Robin Robin Hood? No, not Robin Hood. Magic Hood. Mystic Cap of Devastation. 12% crit chance. <sighs> Delilah. Can we do it again? Mean. I would have been cool if I could have just farmed it. But alas, it is not allowed. We have to move on. We're not gonna go into the poo gas or poo water. Wait, did, did he just go through this thing? Oh, he, he does. Does this thing does not have physicals? It does not collide with our reality. Neither does the bench. But this one does, and this one also. Wow, interesting. Someone forgot to turn on the, the collide. Oh, what the fuck! <laughs> Panic! Oh. Ooh, yellow. Okay, you know what? Fuck this. Actually, nah, fuck it. I'm gonna go and do this small chest. Gonna dip our toes into the concentrated arthritis water. Oh, there's the geometric shapes. Oh, it's just a note. Oh, circle 3141. Oh. oh, it's actually perfectly fine. We don't care. These machines emit a low steady hum. One end is cool to the touch, the other is hot. 
Elaborate contraption, moving gears and mechanical parts. Okay. Sunken chamber. Crates and boxes. Red rust stains four from the between from between the rotted slats of wood. Slat. Smell of iron and rust is overwhelming here. On the top of the of one of them, your champions find a note to the administration. Honor refinery and storage requires a constant supply of specific parts to run properly. Parts cannot be substituted with common lock bolts. Duh. Instead of 20 boxes of cam accelerators and 100 bolts, you send me 100 boxes of bolts and 10 then 20 cam accelerators. What am I going to do with 100,000 lock bolts? Build the tower of, to the sky? Please send parts exactly as they are requested. A bunch of extra shit. I mean, they built trees. A small chest. There's the vibrating gears and metal pistons. Ooh. Pistons. Metal pistons of this machine quietly slide up and down. Their motion is unwavering and for some reason calming. Calming? I would describe it differently. Vibrating gears, the machine vibrates loudly. Ooh, the metal of the back of the unit appears red hot. I mean, I get red hot when I start to vibrate as well. An electric cable. Okay. Looks kind of broken there, doesn't it? Ta! Oh, there too. Eee, eee. Following loud whooshing, swooshing sounds. A loud swooshing sound. A bright blue arc of energy hops from one machine to the other where it disappears without a trace. Power. Raw of, raw of engines. Ah, my grandma had the same bread oven back in the days, only to twenty times smaller. After a moment of complete silence, there on the gauge swings to the other side, following a loud rumble and eruption of black smoke. Okay. Hmm, there's another code. That generator spinning is very quiet. Quietly spinny spins. Chant! Elemental Shatter 2 reduces enemy elemental resistances by 20% for 10 seconds. Multiple do not stack. Ranged weapon. This could be put on one of the tablets. That could be cool. You got Elemental Shatter 1. Hey. And Armor Shatter 1. Hey. Yellow mental shit. Oh, these are things that are on them by default. Oh, look, armor shatter is also unique because it can't be used. Oh, it's the left and right stone eye, that's why. I mean, I could put it on this thing, but I don't think I'll ever use this. I should just break them. What is she using? Utter nonsense. Four edicts. Four. Is this fucking high-pitched vroom 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 noise the generator? Uh, it's not pleasant. Then again, it's at least something else than this fucking calming music. Alright, chest, prepare to be touched. 87 and the tier 2 bootsies what the hell is wrong with you uh 94 monies that's better and the purple one-handed slab of tier 2 11 penetration 12 power increase and i don't even care about any of the shit waterstone of the opposite opposite my ass Whoosh. yeah Gone are the days of caring. We all only care about penetration. Followed by skill power and crits. Yes. Enchant scroll. Oils too. Oil up your legs and you'll regenerate real fast. Wait, 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 what 
is this? Aha! This should connect. Oh, it might be this lever. Creates a little shot. Oh, it's probably gonna create a shortcut once we do this whole fucking maze thing. So let's get there first, I guess. Alright, time to tackle this thing. Actually, no. I want to know what this Edict of Force is. And then we can tackle the platform puzzle. Maybe Kane got a new torch because I leveled him up? Although, no. He's been on level 5 since like the last three, three floors. Hmm. Or edicts of power nodes collected store. Oh yeah, we know these. These are fucking pointless. Damn. The codes don't work. How do they start running away? 7,000 money! Oh boy. How about she's upgrading the uh, the mage stuff again? 1,500, okay. Look, it's the portal. They did all the main quests, what? Why are we still here then? Just to suffer? I guess we're here to the, uh, for the blueprint, and also to find a way down, it's our utmost quest. Oh, look at that ass, ooh, gyrate, yeah, yeah, ladder, ancient ladder, sheet of paper flutters at the edge of the table, held in place by a thick black residue, ew, on a closer inspection it appears to be an official ladder, it's oil, Sergeant Hamish. You are here by order to prepare the devices and traps to slow and confound the devil should they ever enter this level of the tower. Under no circumstances may they be allowed to bridge the gap to the engineering sector. Ah, you are hereby assigned a platoon of our four mages and uh, are advised to use a Titan RX XR6 talisman. Ooh, substantial knowledge is being diverted from the main generator to activate the Titan. Please direct your group across the extra platforms. Secure the Titan with utmost haste, Captain Roman B. Alright, Captain Roman B, here goes nothing. This is where we are. I get to fight the gyrating machine. Yes. What if we pull it again? Oh, look at that! That also does things. Mmm. It slides in. It slides out. Come to me. Oh, it's the ancient god. Ooh, a forgotten prison guard, an example of ancient mechanical skills. Although deactivated for a very long time, its combat potential is still astonishing. Wait, we fought one of these in the actual prison place. Yeah, this guy is absolutely useless. 3,000? 14 armor penetration? 20 armor? Pff, 45? Yeah, this is from the like second floor. Fire and Earth, Blood Rush, Damage Aura. Champions are burning. Okay, Blady Javelin. Cool. The party has seen the enemy before in prison cells on floor. In prison cells. In prison cells on floor. Hey! Eh? Should that be a difficult battle? Wait, what are those lights approaching fast? Uh oh. It's gonna be a twist. I see no twist, twist, twist. Maninata. All right, pussy, come at us. Your wish is my command. It's coming. Whee. Oh my god. It's got friends. Oh my god, it's got a lot of friends. Money Marte. Money Marte, indeed. Let's go. Pop everything on it. Go, go, go. Coming. 
coming, I'm coming. They are melting before our eyes. Yes, My blade is yours to command. Heru, I mean. Look at that. He don't. We don't even care. He's. Oh wow, we're only at twenty-one percent. Speed this up a little bit. More of that. More rain. More golden egg. Okay, he needs more region. Oh, we we done. Oh, it was boss health that was going down. I see. I'm on a region. Oh, we got a ring of the dark sun. Right. I think I heard a cat. Hold on. Damn! Such a cute cat! Ah, uh, Mac, can you tell us anything about these Deva? You saw no sign of them, apart from the broken remains of one of their constructs. Cannot comply. No memory files of the Deva have been erased. I cannot offer any more useful information in this regard. What a useless piece of shit you are. Oh my god, it's a fucking... That's a... <laughs> That's an actual fucking reference. But I don't know to whom. Maybe it's a doctor. I don't know. Doctor what? Maybe? Doctor where? Doctor when? Hmm. Some kind of W. Although, wasn't that a red telephone? Well, you know, it's not a telephone box, it's a... What the fuck it's called? I never watched the show. I, I found the uh, the threat of the fucking talking trash cans very, very stupid. And I was like, yeah, I'm not watching this shit. Exterminate! <laughs> yeah, bullshit. Bullshit! I'm sorry, British people, but it's stupid. Alright, so hopefully this will extend this fucking thing. What in the fuck? We are stranded. On an island of mediocrity. Oh, there's a big, big bridge. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's just good. I think no one else moved or nothing else moved. It's just whatever. Get us closer to our wealth. Wealth goal. Mm. Is this dangling or floating? What the fuck is this thing? It's very janky. It's like... What? I think it's... F oh, it's the water and the surface is moving so the reflection... Because it's, it's sunken. Or at least I think that's what it's trying to emulate, but it looks very bad. <laughs> Got two levers here. Oh no, what is a letter? Never mind. Champions come across a group of skeletons sprawled out on the floor. Clenched on one of their in one of their hands lies a crumbling note. That's not true, it's on the desk. Caked in dried blood. Could be feces. You don't never know. Just taste it, I guess. 
Roman means his foolish platforms. I was a goddamn idiot to follow his orders. I have no idea why he did it, but for whatsoever, whatever reasons, shut off the generator, leaving our entire group stranded. We have to eat each other and swim in the Puges water. It's been over a week now, and the last of us supplies are long gone. We've tried many means. We can think of to move off this platform, and obviously nothing worked. You know, mana to draw from this void. It's now just a matter of time. It's not easy coming to terms with the fact that I'm going to die because of the decisions of a fool. But I wouldn't give to get my hands on his little neck just one time before I die. This skeleton turned into a table. Oh my god, now I hear two cats meowing. One is right beside me. And one is out the door. Yeah? Should I? Son of a bitch! Ah, oh, give me a second. I want to play in the mountain of packaging paper and just have fun I guess well I won't hold it against them let them let them have cake and eat it too I guess let them have caked on letters wait there's a way to go that way as well what is it connected though no I guess we pull this one or we return to the city Ooh, shortcut here. Let's go. That's what I wanted. Yes. So this one here only moves this bridge, right? Oh no, it moves that too. Oh. But how do we... Oh, actually, now we can. Because we walk all the way back. Open that, and then we walk all the way here, and then move across. Easy. Easy game. Nothing on this thing. Nothing on this thing. Only some levers. Actually, this one has two levers. This is hopefully this. Yay. What will this do? Ooh, it's only a positive one as well. Oh, it turns this back on. Okay, we don't even need to go back on the shortcut. They made it super easy. Cool. Super duper easy. We can check this side area as well. It's got its own lever, an old typing device with codes. Ooh. Secret platform code 0515. I'm glad they just put the code right there. It's like, whatever. What does this do? Oh, you're basically done, except that might be the secret platform. What the? St no! I cannot look! My fair maiden, my Eve, is having sex with the robot. I was having sex with. Arr! Was it this? I don't even fucking remember what it was. Zero five. Zero, zero five. Troubles. Oh yeah, that we know that. Geometry and shapes. Expedition. Oh my god. Fucking just look at it again, I guess. Zero five one five. Oh my god. Beep boop. Oh, what? What about that? One. Can we put a bridge to the... Uh, Sunken one? So now we only need to connect one. There's a secret platform. The fight? Oh my god, you look weird. Let's put you down, huh? It's a fucking ACU from Supreme Commander. The Seraphim ACU. <laughs> Not really, but whatever. Experimental Conjurer. 
an experiment of ancient technomancers, a male of experiment of conjurer, with vast quantities of raw mana. Tiny cat wants something soon. This monstrous is the could be the shadow construct in 1v1 fight. Extremely durable, with a very strong range attack, and able to summon two different types of smaller constructs. Ew, what is this sponging? No penetration whatsoever, so we just don't care. Wow, oh, ooh, ouch, ooh, ee. Fire and water, what happened to you? I guess earth and air. Summon metal terror. Summons four armored flying metal insects with 400 health, 60, 70 damage, 18 armor and zero elemental resistance each. Remain on the battlefield until killed. So I guess this can... Oh, this is gonna be like the spider fight when he just keeps summoning bullshit. Summon energy crossbow. Three energy crossbows with fire and health, long range attack. Oh my god. 60 health or 60 seconds or until destroyed. Metal terror. Armnort flying metal insect with 4,000 health. Bunch of fucking damage. Armor and elemental resistance, 40%. Oh my god. Stun wave. Creates a field of static. Static. With a <laughs> static static. Radius of 10 meters for 10 seconds in 100 damage. Oh my god. Bad. Fuck it. Fuck it. We kill it. We don't care. We kill it. Yes. We're just gonna fucking hose it down. Let's go hose right. it down, boys. Oh my god, he's going! Ah, boink! Hey, he got fucking Money interrupted. Matter. Money matter. Onwards to the fray. Oh, don't don't look at it. Don't look at it. Oh god. Okay, we need we need this guy around for healing for or you know keeping glory. Shoot them. Keeping the ranged ones safe. My lord? Unleash hell. My knee. The water is not gonna do much, but I mean we do have the debuff on it, so it's only 73% resistance, you know. Yes, moving! It's whatever. Advancing. Oh my god. I hear noises. That's gonna be uh Ah painful. Oh my god, what are those? Are those a crossbows? Why are they there? Money Marte. Kill him. Yeah, they just disappeared. Put some healing down. Put another of these boys down. Yes, my lord. Do some damage. Money Marte. I guess yes. we're doing it though. Put the defense or the weakness mark. Yeah, he's dying. My blade is yours. Put on some armor. Your service. Just gonna focus it down real hard. Also gonna spam some hammers in its way so it knows we mean business. There, it's dead. Oh, that's a big ass murder insect. Victory! 11,000, almost 12,000 damage. Yeah, he just stood there and killed it. This guy helped. These guys did stuff, but I mean. Fire or water resistance, so these guys didn't do much. He also dealt that nice amount of damage. I, I guess he has earth and air, I think. Or, yeah, I think he has earth and air, so he was actually good in the normal attacks against the thing. And her physical and basically almost constant crits, just, yeah. Got a hammer, a two handed tier three, and a purple staff. Okay. I'm okay with that. We'll probably break the hammer. It's physical. Actually, it's one-handed. Never mind. One-handed physical hammer. Oh, we also had this ring for a while now. Ring of the Dark Sun. Resistances. Immunity to blind. So a second blind immunity thing. Health points. Less health regen. Why? Two might and two life. Stun immunity or blind immunity? I feel like stun immunity is better on this guy. He definitely wants to keep the thorns. Blind immunity. She kind of needs this penetration stuff. It's cool. And this is... To my two life. Three... Oh! <gasps> A tiny cat! Hold on.
I swear, every time it meows, it's different. I actually got spooked a little bit. I was like, what the fuck? I th thought they were killing each other for a second, but... Henrik just wanted to leave. Playtime was that. And they separate for a while, and then they play again. How does she have six points? Oh yeah, because I took everything out of this. And then put it in this. I guess we can pump it up a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a tad little bit. You know, just just, just a tiny bit. Alright, what do we do get? Oh yeah, I was looking at these. So three might. What can I enchant on this garbage? I think it's just one mana per, per head. Yeah, it's absolute garbage. Mm-hmm. On health regen, on mono regen. Her mono regen is getting very close to being garbage. Health regen would be fine. She's got a heap of health regen. Two might, two life. Life she doesn't need. Blind immunity. I mean, she doesn't really care about that. It's probably this guy that would benefit from it because this guy is getting hit a lot more. Now the other kid is meowing. What the fuck is happening right now? Going berserk. Alright. This is his mana ring with mastery that gives him some fire damage. And this is his penetration ring that he doesn't need. 42 penetration, more penetration than this one. Holy shit, his penetration is through the roof. Armor he doesn't really care about. Honorary gem movement speed is okay, but what is this again? Resistances, that's nice. Yeah, let's give him this. Let's break this for good measure. But we don't ever need to look at it ever again. Wow, he actually has some cool, unique looking ring. I mean, it's just tier 3 yellow, but... You know. It's not as unique looking as that sword we broke, because it was stupid. Yeah. <laughs> that guy still has the tier 1 fucking corrupted gauntlets. What's his actual thing? 520, yeah, I mean... I feel like I could make something better. Heavy gloves, purple. So you could have uh, 5 armor, 12, 20 health points. Well, actually no, it's tier 2. You can't make tier 3 yet. Good chance he doesn't need resistance. 6 armor. 30 health points and 4 thingies, yeah. What is this armor, again? 6. 13 resistances and 8. 25 health. Honestly, yeah, I could just get rid of this. Oh my god. He would lose the crit chance, but... <laughs> oh my god, he's meowing in the darkness. Love it. <laughs> I think he's upset that the tiny one left and uh, he's gotta play it on. <clears throat> Maybe I should play with my cat instead of doing this shit. Yeah, because this is... Although the resistance is would go to shit. Let's craft one. It's garbage. Garbage too. Yeah, they're still garbage. Same armor. I mean, they are purple. So I can enchant them. What can I put in my hand? Magi gloves, skill cooldown, he does not care about that. This is look like some kind of might gloves or warrior gloves or something. That might be cool, although it might just give knock back. Looks like a fist that goes real fast. Yeah. Resistance is... Well, we made them, so might as well. I mean, this guy also has tier 1. It's the speedy one. Attack speed and cooldown. Penetration? Oh my god, even more penetration. Ooh. Minus 30 mana though. And no cooldown. Although, 10% not as interesting. Oh, excuse me. Mana regen, health points. Okay. Two might. Yeah, that's good. Bing bong. Let's keep moving. Oh my god, Tesla and Edison? Whoa, Vond is gonna get broken, and the staff is probably also gonna get broken because we're using tablets, but that's nice. <laughs> I 
Tier 2 plus. An air one with days magic penetration. Yeah, that's shit. That's the staff. It's tier 3. Alright, so the wand is immediately going away. Oh my god! Oh, we also got this thing. Chaotic mist. Chaotic. Fucking hell. Mystic staff on incineration. Earth and fire. 24% penetration, but I mean, I lose. I lose 44. So I, you know, I lose some. I lose a lot. Because from 59 it goes to 35. Blah. Left stone, I right stone. It's more DPS this way. So this shock. What does this do? Oh my god, a lot of air resistance. Air damage, kind of meh. Nah, yeah, 29% penetration. Three mana per hit. It's just whatever. It's kind of shit. Although this staff is quite fast. Look at that. 0.31. Skip power increase 3. No crit. Yeah, it's, it's trash. What can we forge on this? More magic penetration. So it could be 33% magic penetration. That's still 11% less than what we have. Sorry to say, but I, it's kind of poop. Got the void damage on the void girl. That kind of fits. And this garbage. Oh, she would have a tier 2. Goldstone. Another goldstone. Yeah. yeah, look at all the purple we have. Oh, I could craft so much, but there's no point. Hey, let's just scroll. Health 3 gem per second. One's life force is precious and rated with digital pressure portion. Blah, 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 blah. We read this before. Life regeneration. Yours is 3.4 and yours is 5.0, so I guess 3.4 gets it. Because the other two, and the, the unused ones obviously don't need it, and the other two are ideally not getting hit. Also, she's through the roof with health regen, and he can, uh, he, he can heal himself, you know? It's fine. Yeah, this guy needs some mana regen, although it's fine. It's fine. Out with code! Titan Spirit Enchantment! 0409, okay. Do we want that? Secret platform. We got the big bridge. Everything is connected except this. No, this one. Wait, what? Hold on. Gotta go back and look at the overview, so we're gonna pull something. Wait, there was a way to connect dues. I think it was the first lever. So we have to go back here, pull that, and then we go use the shortcut. Yes. Yes. Is this the first? No, it's not. Uh, it's the side one.
There's a power hidden deep within the cat's soul. A power. And there we go. Power unlike any other. The power to meow. The power to purr. The power to claw your leg so hard. With no effort. That your leg just kind of folds open. That happened actually. Not this dramatic, but it's going to leave a scar for a while. During Easter, I got cat scratched on the leg, and it's, it's nice. I got a new battle scar. <laughs> oh, except battle, it was playtime, but I'll teach me to wear shorts around cats when they are running. They just claw the shit out of me. Ooh, money. Strange suit. Ooh. Now you're getting into the kink suit territory. Hell yeah. Put your kink suits on, everybody. Get ready to breathe that fart in. A TARDIS. That's what the foam thing called. TARDIS. Champions puzzle at the sight of this strange box. Struck in speculates that it can be a closet of some kind. It's a suicide box from Amazon warehouses. Some kind of some kind of perhaps a tomb. And they peer inside, they notice large carving on one of the metal wall. Advice for wannabe adventure. It is nothing there's something which doesn't make sense. Let's go and poke it with a stick. The champions marvel for a second at this wonderful advice. Let's touch it. Touch it with a stick stick a stick up its ass. So this is the other side thingy. The Enchant Scroll of City and Edge 3. Wow, we didn't really need the two. We just got three. 60% is bleeding. Enchantment. Oh my god. <laughs> the cat. The cat is attacking the world. It's consuming. Life Force Spirit Enchantment. 993. Suicide Hotline. Oh my god, tier 2 purple. With 99 bucks. Blah. 88. Give me a hundred bucks in gold. I guess hundred bucks in gold is 84 gold. Inflation. 95. What is that? That looks kind of cool, but it's uh, kind of dookie. It's still not giving me tier 2 or tier 3 boots for armor. It just does not get. Okay, 99. Close enough. Give me some glovers. And they are sheet day. What do you want? Play time? Oh, he wants to play. We're at four hours. I might just, I might just end the stream and exhaust the cat. Oh my god, 41. Yeah, this is shit. But first we need to touch this box. Whoa, tier three ring of health. Whoa, 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 whoa. Could have been an upgrade to Rockham, but I think he already replaced that health ring with the uh, Dark Sun. <gasps> Tier 3 Bootsies! For armor people! Yes, that's what I wanted! Alright, so same armor, barely better resistance, a little extra health, less movement. Fucking hell! Why is this so shit? Then again, it's a random chest. Oh my god, what the fuck? How is this better? Oh, it's probably the four enchants are four different, or the four forges are four. Yeah, four different resistances. <laughs> what a good investment that was. It's as good as this tier three. Although this would give movement speed, attack speed, minus 8% crit. Fucking. Duh. 
Ah! That's my face when I open these chests. Oh, it's tier 3 boots is for her. A ventilation boots of obsidian. Less resistance, more armor, less health, more movement speed. I mean, she's already running. 9.1. Sprinting is 15. I guess 15 is the max. Maybe. 1% more attack speed. 10% less crit chance. Bruh. Bruh, I cannot allow such disgusting things to happen. Then again, I could lose that 10% because I can just put on more fucking armor or arrow things, but... Ah, speaking of arrow things, this is garbage. It's a magic bow. Alright, one more roll and we'll take whatever we get. It's a lot of green crystals and a two-handed hammer. Two-handed hammer red, less speed, more damage, Fire instead of air. Stun chance, same cleave, less penetration. 20% skill power, no crit. What can I put on? So I can put on penetration. What is this? 24. So I could make this 24. I could make this 28. And I could give it 3% crit chance. Wow. He doesn't really need crit. However, he's got 44% and he's slow. So... Better than 8. A lot better than 8. What a pain. Oh. Right. Well, there's my cat. Oh, my cat is now waiting, I think. He's just lying down on the floor. Maybe he gave up on the pursuits of happiness. He's dead inside now. I can relate. Okay, so all of this is done. Yeah. But I might still end the stream. Because we are at four hours. I wanna get some dindin too. What the fuck is this? Was it the small chest? <laughs> I guess it's a purple, we could get more resistance aura. Better armor, we don't care. Magic penetration and penetration is better. That's good. Movement speed is less. That's okay, she's a 9.1. Yeah, sure, she'll get that. A little enchanted. Beat thumb. Thorns! Haha, <laughs> no. Skill damage she doesn't need. Armor aura. Armor. She could have. Oh! Oh yeah, the, the the feet armor are the uh, resistance things. She could have some, uh, some material absorption. So our 2.4, 2.9 goes to... Uh, it froze. Oh, there we go. 5.2! Alright, it also blinked. Oh no. Well, 5.2 is good. That's good for her. That's, that's nice. All right, let's let's end here because. Oh, but that lesser scroll and the ancient chest. Ah, oh, uh, something to look forward to, I guess. Uh, this. Um, I loaded, didn't die. Sheet, sheet. No, the boot, the pants. No, the pants are gone. <laughs> No, it's garbage now. What even is this shit? Yuck. I loaded up the fucking save instead of saving. I got so scared for a second. I was like, what the fuck happened? <laughs> oh, purple. Purple with money, money mate. All right, are these better? It could be better. Move <gasps> Movement speed, attack speed, health. Mana increase. A little less health points, but 5% extra health, so he's gonna go back up to f 700. He can have the enchant on it, and we can forge it to get more armor. So we lose one armor. 101. But we gain some movement speed. We gain some life. Some DPS is lost. 
Actually, it's gained. Oh. Oh yeah, attack speed. It's better than the speed it gives, yeah. Yeah, I'll take it. One armor. Or some movement speed. Yeah, 5.2 is good. Victories, shit. Enchant feetsies. With wing shoes! Ha ha! Ha ha! Never! It's so bullshit. Nice. Yeah, now we save. There we go. Perfect! Anyways, that's it for today. It's a big level, but somehow I feel like it's going faster than the previous level, where I derped around for so long. Anyways, I uh, hope you enjoyed. The Descent into Madness, Volume 2. Uh, we'll upgrade the dudes later and see how their character models change. Goodbye.